September 11th next week? 580 Gate. Just went to the Renaissance Fair for the first time. Woo-oo. I'm driving. 27 month prime sub to soften the plow. GLHF. Soon the six month server process will stop bugging out on the sag. Ooh, Papa, give me that sugar. Hey, buddy, I'm getting married in May. Wanna come? 26 months. Ireland. VIP for DJs and Puzzle Gang. 20 month anniversary. Love you, Mums. 34 months and I just peed out of my butt the Travis fails. Almost to the six month server block. Virginity rules. Woo. I magic Monday. <sighs> uh, hope Sonny gets his ass. Listen, I'm tired today, but I have a good excuse. Okay, so. Woo ho ho. So get, get. Two years where ogre in. I wear shirts that people send to me because oh, it makes me happy. Doing? Card Hello, chat. Hello. Man, I'm operating, and I know I have a new excuse every time, but this one actually matters, okay? I am so I am so tired because... And I'm going to talk more about this on Wednesday because today's Magic Monday, and I'm not going to... I'm not going to weigh us down in the details of interesting stories on Magic Monday. That's going to get in the way of cards. But last night...
I was playing Starfield at like midnight. I get up and I notice there's a trail through the house of like reddish liquid. And I'm like, great, great. So I inspect the kitties and uh, unfortunately Alex was is dying. No, uh, I inspect the kitties and I see HP dripping and I'm like, uh oh. So I go look at him and I lift his tail and just bloody water comes out of him. And uh, long story short, he's doing okay now. I think he's being. I'm having to isolate him in a in a room. It's very sad. Uh, I feel very bad for him. Uh, he literally blood farted. Um, I I we were pretty sure he's okay. Um, but I'm gonna go through the whole story. Oh God, dude, can I just say? I, vets, I'm sure you guys are great. We love vets. We stand vets. Doctors are overworked, whatever. But also fuck everyone who I dealt with last night. Okay, I'll talk about that later. Um, and, and I'll talk about it on Wednesday. I'll tell the whole story on Wednesday. But I am, I'm, you know what, dude? I'm so tired. I'm just mad. I'm mad and I have a headache. That's where I'm at. But I was like, I really want to do Magic Monday. I really don't want to miss it. Um, just to give you guys an idea, I was there for about seven hours last night and I got home at 8 a.m. I got home at 8, I want you to think about that. Not 8 a.m. because I, I, 8 a.m. being, I went to bed by around 8.30, 9 a.m. Your HP printer is leaking ink. You know what my brother said? I called my brother because my brother knows like 24 hour vets here. He goes, he's been to one multiple times. So I'm like, bro, what vet did you go to 24 hours? I need a vet like now. And he gave it to me. And my brother's text me, he's like, oh, I hope everything's okay. And then before my, my brother, by the way, not the edgiest, very pretty clean cut. He likes funny stuff, but not the edgiest. He texts me so out of nowhere. He goes, by the way, while you're on your way, did you try turning him off and turning him on again? And I was like, that's a good one. My cat's dying, but that's a good one. That's funny as fuck. He's like, thank you. I'm like, but by the way, we don't know if he's okay yet. <laughs> But I, I, I do like that kind of humor. It, it, it made me laugh. It made me happy. Uh, but yeah, no, I'm not trying to scare anyone because it's it's th today, all day that I've been awake, I've been monitoring him. He's not dripping anymore. He seems to be doing okay, right? Uh, this isn't a sob story. This is a explanation of my night. But I'm going to talk about it uh, on Wednesday because there's some fun stories that have come out of it. And honestly, uh, ultimately, all it is is uh, it makes me appreciate you know, my cats more, put them in rice. <laughs> right. Like, like at the end of the day, when your pet goes through anything and then doesn't die, all it does is make you go, damn, these things are not immortal. Right. And you need to take care of them and everybody just hug you, pet your damn kitty. You know, my cats annoy the shit out of me, but the second something was happening, I was like, Oh, I should have been nicer. And I need to, I need to pet him. I need to make sure everything. like it gets, it's, it's, I know like H3 just lost his dog and like people on the suburb always post about their pets, man. And it's easy to look at it and just move on. But like, it's, it do be sad. It do be sad. Losing a pet is, is it's, it's so devastating. It's almost like, fuck, I don't want another pet. You know, why do we put ourselves through this? But you know what Dr. Seuss said? He said, I'm going to beat the shit out of my wife. So it's something, you know? All right, we, but instead of, um, instead of, of talking about my cat today, I'm going to open some magic cards with you guys, and I hope you enjoy. Will Wubby pull a chase card? I, if I don't pull a single chase card, I might legitimately kill myself. I'm on, I'm on the edge here. I'm letting you know. If I do not pull a single one of these cards, it's very unlikely. So just, you know, it's very, if you're voting on not pulling, not a good odds. Very likely I'll pull one. I think ultimately... I want a Volcanic Island and Wheel of Fortune. It's the second one in on the first row and the third one in on the second row. That's really what I want. I pulled almost everything from the set because we've opened so many of these before. Um, we need our fourth underground seat. Exactly, bro. I will say this, though. Okay. Because I like Revised a lot. It's a fun set. I actually need a couple of these cards for my deck. I need an underground seat for my deck. So if I pull an underground seat today... I will be using it in my deck, which is a weird way of opening cards on stream. I, I only ever collect them, so I'm actually kind of excited. <laughs> I smell diarrhea. Uh, bro, you need to make a Magic the Gathering channel. I actually think I'm going to where I just upload all my magic stuff because it's getting to a point where um, I have so many 
like one of a kind things. Like when you guys pointed that out, I'm the only person who have opened a Portal 3 Kingdoms box online. As far as we're aware, it's like that should be documented somewhere. Um, so, all right. But I also, okay. I'm gonna pull one pack out randomly. Okay, I'm gonna pull one pack out randomly from this box and uh, we're gonna set it aside. And then at the end of stream, I'm gonna give it away to a random sub. You can choose to open it or not. You can choose to open it with the audience or not. We will see. So we're gonna pull one pack randomly, just one, okay? Uh, and I'm gonna give it away to one sub in chat at the end. We'll see how that goes. And I don't know what to, I, okay. I'm gonna be honest with you. Opening these boxes is, is money loss, right? If I, if, if this is what I dedicated my content to, I would be net negative until I'm out of money, right? That's the reality of this, right? However, I love doing it. It's so fun. It's my favorite thing. So here's, the, I'm just going to be fully transparent. I want to open this today on stream. I want to crack into its acrylic prison and open this today, right? I want to. I want to open this, okay? The problem I'm having, and I, if I really didn't want to, I wouldn't have even brought it out. But the problem I'm having right now is that I'm like, should I put a sub goal? Should, or like, what? Because I can't justify losing this and this. It's just... It's literally setting on fire like $20,000. You're too weak to open it. My brother in Christ, we have opposable thumbs. What are you talking about? I, I can hold a screwdriver. I can hold a drill. Bro, what are you? A, is there a caveman in my chat? Bro, you don't have the grip strength to open that. Bro's gonna be blown away by like construction. Uh, see how the box treats you then follow up? I guess so, but like, guys, you don't understand. This poor, innocent PSA 10 Arabian Nights booster pack is trapped within the confines of, of plastic. And it wants to be free because what if there's a library in here? What if there is a bazaar or a juz, juz, juzum jin? What if he's balls, in here? You don't have the hair on your nutsack needed to open that card. <laughs> So you guys really think that me going, listen, we should probably set a sub goal. We should set something reasonable that can be achieved while also being worth it to me. And your response to hearing that is, well, no balls. So I hope that actually works out for you. No balls. Someone just put in chat brackets persuade plus two do it. Okay. Here's my response to that. Red symbol bar did not fill up. You think that's going to work on me? You now have two more chances. Oh, that's three. Two more chances. Okay. No bars have been filled up. Sorry. Are we really star... Are we role play starfielding right now? What's going on right now? <laughs> oh, you're rolling a d20. Okay. Roll the d20. Ooh. Critical success. You rolled a 20. Chat gives 30,000 subs. <laughs> and it worked. We gave you 60 subs for a subathon. Okay, that is plus four. However, I'm going to give you a problem with that. Um, I, I will actually, I'll reveal the total financials of that once it's all squared away. But I'll say this. At the end of it all, given what was spent on the box too and everything like expenses, splitting with Alex, uh, uh, Twitch's cut, everything. I'm just going to say it. It's not worth it. It's honestly not worth it. The, 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 not that it's not, I'm not appreciative of it. I'm saying, I think I will just stick to normal streaming. It's just so, it's insane how, how many hands get to go into it before it actually hits your account. And then, you know, you get this image of, oh my, dude, I got like 60K subs. Oh shit, I have this much money. Wait, wait oh, there, oh, there goes half. Oh, there goes another third of that. Oh, and then all these payouts. Oh, and then the box. It's like, oh, yeah, the government. I'm not saying it's bad, by the way. Like, guys, money is fucking money, right? But if I told you, here's a hundred grand, if I handed you a hundred grand, you're gonna start, and for a whole, you know, two weeks, you're gonna be, oh my God. And then I go, I need half back. It's like, oh, okay, I still, that's crazy, I still have 50. I need 30% of that now. Okay, fuck. You know, fuck, fuck your money, what? Fuck money, gotcha. You know what, I'm not opening this. This is my magic Monday, I'll do what I want. I triple dog dare you, I'm opening it. We'll see. I like the idea of we'll, we'll, we'll see. Okay, we'll, we'll do. So one person in chat's going to get one pack from here at the end. Uh, and until then, let's open this. All right. And I don't want anyone to judge me. I don't know where a knife is right now. So I'm going to be opening the, the, 
wrap on here with toenail clippers okay and if you're wondering wubby why are you calling these toenail clippers as opposed to nail clippers because you get two in a package okay you get two in a package and this is the bigger one so why would who would use this on their look look imagine me my pinky right look at this it's twice the size of my pinky these are toenail clippers thank you it's true thank you heathens all right let's let's do this um so this is a revised box and uh it's probably fake we're gonna find out right now could you imagine i have yet to be hit with a fake box on stream yet i've been we got scammed on an arabian nights booster pack the only one i've ever opened we got scammed on an arabian nights booster pack there was no rare which is not even a repack issue it's a printing error it was insane i talked to rudy from alpha investments about it wrong you got scammed okay anyway uh rip no rare i know it sucks that's part of the reason i want to open this uh, don't use your teeth. I'm not gonna use my teeth. I'm gonna use so you think this is repacked? Hold on. Let's look I'm gonna find out wouldn't that just suck, bro? I think I would be so devastated I would cry if I bought a, a box like this and I had it sitting for so long. This is so... Bro, this is trashy as fuck <laughs> uh... <laughs> Whoa, okay, there it is Whee! Who the fuck just said teeth clippers? Why do you guys ruin everything dude? <laughs> Also, I have a couple things um, I wanted to talk about. The first thing is we are working on a very special thing for Magic Monday that we are, I'd say, 80% of the way done with, maybe 70%, okay? But uh, I'm just going to explain it to you. There is a wor current working prototype on my boy's computer who's setting it up. The idea, uh, it's an idea that's been tossed around before, didn't think it was possible, then I forgot about it. Somebody on the subreddit, this was years ago, somebody on the subreddit brought it up. And I had this like, oh shit, that's such a good idea. Why haven't we tried with all, with what we know now, right? With what I'm capable of now, what my friends are capable of now. So basically we have this prototype working that while I'm opening magic cards, okay? It's a program that runs on your computer. It scans the face of the card, puts the name and the TCG low price of it right next to it during stream as we're cycling through cards. Now. Uh, I guess I'll just say DJ is is coding it for me and creating it for me, and he showed me a working prototype last night. It is so fucking cool. The problem that we're running into, what's up, DJ? The problem we're running into is certain specifics. It can pretty loosely handle old sets like this where there's no full arts and no foils and shit like that. But I talked to him about opening the new set, Wilds of Eldraine or whatever it is, the new one that's coming out, and. We're start there's all these little things that come up and long story short i'm out of a job it's a mr mustache this is better though trust me um uh so we're working out oh, there's all these little things as anyone who knows who's ever made anything million little things come up and we're in the million little things stage of it but uh it's already exists it's called oh, it already exists hold on it's called delver lens and it's great okay to what extent does it exist, though? Because does it exist in what we're, the application I'm literally looking at, looking at it for? It, yes, it exists for, like, stream, though. Can it scan my camera, that, this camera right here, while I'm live and put an overlay on OBS? You're saying yes, more or less. Okay, but here's the thing. Chat, you're stupid. When you say more or less, I look into it, and it's not at all viable. It's like, yeah, it's a phone app. Cool. Oh, yeah, that's not more or less, motherfucker. That's called less. That's called, that's called a different app, dude. No, it wouldn't work on stream. Then, then why the fuck are you suggesting it? What's wrong with you? God, what the fuck's wrong with you? Sorry, I have no patience. My cat's dying. What's wrong with you? Oh, God. You got me acting up. So stupid. Bro, it already exists. What are you doing? It doesn't fucking exist then. <sighs> Thank you. Thank you. Moving on. See, this is why we can't upload these videos, dude. All the old frog magic guys who want to see a revised box open, they're going to see me, like, screaming at my chat over some shit, drinking a sun-kissed out of a gamer subs cup. Like, who the fuck is this guy? All right, um, here we go. Big moment of truth here. Is this a fake box? You guys ready? Looks pretty good. Looks pretty good. I say this as someone who really doesn't know what it would look like if it was bad. I guess it would look um, <laughs> like random packs. They look like they're in good condition. Now, chat, I'm going to draw your pack right from the middle. You ready? Here we go. I'm just going to go down, and this is the this is the saved right here. It's like four packs in. Obviously fake. They look big compared to your hands. That's just mean. It's not GI Joe cards. Yep. Okay, here we go. Chat, this is your pack. 
Okay. How do I do this in a way that you don't think it's switched? Here, look. Always visible. Okay. So now... Oh, shit. It could have got switched there. Oh, my God. There's so many ways to do this. All right. Give me... Hey, you could, you could win. Swapped. You never know. All right. There's that. Okay. There's that. Ooh. There's so many. Oh, my God. It's like 36 or something. Okay. All right. We're going to move the box over here. Okay. All right. Did you see it? I saw the swap. <laughs> you guys are so stupid, dude. Okay. So... Um, big pulls tonight. Hoping, I don't think we've ever pulled Mr. Volcano. I don't think we've ever pulled him. Uh, we've pulled Underground Sea a few times. I wouldn't not be excited. I could use that for my deck. I've never pulled Wheel of Fortune, which is one I want. I think I've pulled all the others. Swapping right now. Oh, fuck. Sorry. Whatever. Dude, who gives a fuck? Um, what would, what, let's try to think that through. What would I be swapping these packs with? 36 other packs that I've searched off camera that are all big pulls or something. <laughs> talk about, dude, talk about like a multi, multi, multi thousand dollar scam for who? These don't even get uploaded to YouTube. Uh, is this set mapped? I don't know, actually. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. It's moving, sorry. Um, all right, how much to rip, flip and rip? Uh, 100 subs. 100 subs to, to flip and rip. I... Uh, wait. Yeah, I'll do that. No, wait. It needs to be worth it. No, because you, you could rip like an $800 card. Not worth? Yeah, it's probably not worth. No, it's not worth because 100 subs is $500 to Twitch, and then I get a percentage of that. No, it's so not worth. <laughs> but it's revised? You rip your fucking revised pack then, bro. Also, you got to understand too, chat. You got to understand this other thing. This is very important, and it's not don't easy do to it. understand. It's bad. You don't, you don't understand this if you don't like magic. This is worth more to me than the cost because I, I, I want to do this. $5,000 single dono. $5,000 single dono? I'll rip, I'll rip fucking five packs. Uh, I'm not even lying. $5,000 single dono? I'll rip five packs. Hella worth. I could take that five grand and justify opening this then. Wait, wait, we're, we're, th now we're cooking, but that's not going to happen then, right? That's not going to happen. All right. Let's start with our first pack. Helton Shelter. Thank you for the five. Appreciate you guys supporting this addiction. It allows me to bring, okay, I'm, listen, this is your fucking pack, okay? I'm going to move it off to the side now. If you think I'm switching it, then you know what? Don't enter in the giveaway, okay? Here we go. I'm going to remove this. I'm moving it over here. I'm going to move it down. I'm going to move it off. Scroll, hold, wait, hold, uh, hey, Wubby Chat can't hear this. Uh, Let me know when to swap their pack with the garbage stop, pack. Stop, stop. TT, no, they can hear. They can hear. They can hear. TT, they can hear. Okay, I'm going to move this pack out of the frame now. Don't move it. Why? I. Okay, I'm moving it down. Here we go. I'm going to move it down. Oh, is that a pro here? I'll, I'll bring it back. I'm sorry. I'll bring it back. Okay, there. Here it is. Here's the one. We're going to give it away. I'll put it back in frame. You guys are so needy, dude. I'll put it back up here, just so you guys know. Okay, okay, I'll put it back. This is not funny. Why do you guys watch this shit? Uh, George R.R. Farton, thank you for the five. Scarblade, thank you for the five. Appreciate you. Seriously, thank you guys. Okay, here it is. I'll just set it off to the side. Who knows which pack it is now? Um, not me. Look, it's under chat. That's how you guys know, okay? That's actually perfect. Can I have the other pack? Bro, this shit's empty. Um, how did you... Did, how didn't you notice those infinity packs were fake? They were way too big compared. Bro, why are you good? That is the meanest thing ever. That is the meanest thing ever. Big Bear, thank you for the... the okay, now I don't remember... Dude, I've opened hundreds of these and I don't... Wow, that opened easily. <gasps> this was like already split. Uh-oh. What order are these cards going in now? I do, I do not remember. How many is it to the back? Let's look it up. I'm gonna look it up before I even do this pack. Okay, these feel, oh boy, okay. I'm gonna look it up right now. Let's look up, uh, no rares in any packs. That would be horrific. Uh, let's see here, revised MTG opening. I just need to see where the uh, rare is. Uh, come on, open boosters, nice. wrap it up. Now, God, he's so he's wearing gloves for revised. What a nerd! You say things in your head, and they okay. It's, come it's out wrong sometimes. Three to the back. Wait, no. Shh. What the fuck did he just do? Hold on. What? What is he doing? What is 
he doing here? He's fucking moving all these cards around. Bro, it's, he's making this rocket science. He doesn't. Oh, I'll go to the door. What? Okay, he has a pack in his hand. I'm going to show you what he does. I'm going to copy exactly what he does. He's got oh, one, rare. Two, three. Okay, so it'd be four to the back. Four to the back. Four to the back. There we go. Okay, here we go. Time to find out. Now, I'm not going to... I don't claim to know every fucking rare. Second stack from the left, three packs down, is ripped. Second stack, three... A little bit, a little bit of a rip there. A little bit of a rip there. A little bit of a rip there. I'm gonna sneeze on these cards. <laughs> Bro, this is why I can't upload this on YouTube. People actually gonna freak out. All right, let's find out. First pack, I'm, do you guys, by the way, I was wondering, do you guys want zoomed in or zoomed out? When it's zoomed out, I feel like people can't see. When it's zoomed in, I feel like people get claustrophobic. Do you like this? Is this good? Here, let's just look at the first card. Is this good? Is it too far? What do you think? Is this good? Good? It's fine? Okay, there's fog. Stone rain. I can I can zoom in easily, so just let me know. Stone rain. Ray's dead. Holy strength. It's a little foggy. Ah, forest. Flight. Disenchant. There's a few other cards I'm looking for too here. Swamp. Island. I'm not going to say it. I'm not going to say it. Mountain. We have to go back to the planes, Jack. <laughs> Air elemental. Okay, we're getting close. Orcish artillery. Lure. I hate lure. And... <laughs> first fucking pack, bro! A duel in the first fucking pack, bro! It's not repack. Bru okay, I'll give it... A no, I won't zoom in. First... Fucking pack not resealed a dual land. We got the Bayou just like that boys. That's already a chase bottom right of our chase That's a four hundred and fifty dollar card according to our boy. Mr. Mustache. Thank you Whole laddie whole laddie and I also came prepared today Bro first fucking pa you know what I hate though. You know what I hate about first pack being a Bayou. I Hate that everything it's all downhill now it's all downhill now. Um, let me, how should I sleeve these? Should I do a dragon shield and then a top loader? I think I'll do that. Like, how can, how can we go up from here? We're going to look at this in a second. Also, I got the white backed, white mat, just so we can, so it really just, mm, your card gets lost in it. The centering is really off. Whatever, though. Um, <clears throat> came too quick. Yeah, I know. Volcanic Island, Underground Sea next. I know. Now you're going to pull nothing else upside down you did it the wrong way my brother you think i don't know how to sleeve you think i don't know how to sleeve i didn't do it the wrong way now look look upside down my brother now there's no way air can, air or anything can get into this card look at this this is how you sleeve right here dipshits that's how you double sleeve okay morons look look look. if you did it that way there'd be a lovely way for air to get in here now this is the top and this is the opening <laughs> Why are you coming at me sideways? Double wrapped. Okay, first dual land, first pack. It's all downhill from here. That's uh I'm gonna separate what should I separate here? I'll just leave it all. Fuck it. Alright. How come these cards look a little faded? Because Name the program DJ is working on me. Mustache. So he isn't out of a job. What? Uh, on, the reason why these cards look faded is because revised looks kind of faded. Uh, and if you compare it to unlimited, uh, which is almost an exact same printing almost uh unlimited is very vibrant in fact if we pull an underground sea i will show you side by side wubby you should have you reviewed oppenheimer i talked about it on yesterday's stream briefly Ooh, and holy strength <clears throat> i talked about it on yesterday's stream briefly um but i didn't give like an in-depth review and i probably want won't because i want you guys to see it island mountain god the way old cards feel it's so they feel so different Almost, if you're used to new cards now, jump. Hey, Tog. Wait, didn't you guys say somebody looked like this? They feel so different. They all, I don't want to say it, but if you're used to current cards, these cards feel fake. And I guess if you're used to old cards, new cards feel fake. Jump rocks. Desert Twister. I know this from Arabian Nights. Green Ward. Okay, we got our boy Spectre. Is this last, last card? Here we go. And for the rare, how can we follow up a dual land? How can we follow up a dual land? How about another? <sighs> Demonic Attorney. Okay, not bad. Not bad. I'm going to sleeve, I think, 
most of the rares. <clears throat> not quite though. Not quite a dual land. Not quite. Have you felt the new Eldrain cards yet? Two dollars. Okay. Two dollars. Not bad. Not bad. It's not bad. It's not terrible. Um, I'm trying to have a complete revised set, like every card. I have. I think I have nearly everything. I think I'm only missing a couple of rares at this point because we've opened like three boxes on here. <laughs> um, what are you missing from revised? I think we're missing Volc the Volcano Boy, Wheel of Fortune, a few others. I don't know. I need to look. Um, what did you put? HP's award. <laughs> well, uh, it was it got left at the hospital last night. Okay. I was going to put out a tweet. And I was going to at stream rewards and at cutie and be like, you gave my cat an award and now he's dying. But then I was like, man, if he really dies, then we're like, like, this ain't funny then. And then everyone's gonna be like, dude, what the fuck? Imagine really pulling American tobacco. What, what are you talking? This is my fifth revised box. God damn. God damn. We opened too much revised, but you know what? It's fine. We still haven't pulled every fucking rare from it, which drives me crazy. Kurt Ape! Dude, I was looking at building a monkey deck on, uh, on, uh, um, what's that website that has all the commander decks? I wanted to build a monkey deck so bad just because Curd Ape is so dumb to me. A lot of these old cards are just so silly. It's like, yeah, it's, um, it's a monkey. This one's a camel. Um, yeah. Okay, presents. Forest. Fork, fucking fork, dude. Dog shit, whatever. It'll lose to a bear deck. You're so, dude, that's just, dude, that's not okay. Is that my father? Is that, is that Giga Chad my father? It's Giga Dad. Oh my God. And that's him with, the, oh my God. And that's him with the, the chef hat. And there he is. Oh my God, this is so weird. <laughs> Bro, that <laughs> fork is 44 bucks. I guess it's better than the other one. <clears throat> Oh my god, he's gonna love that. Dude, true, my dad yesterday was legitimately so fun. I was having such a goof. My dad killed me a couple times with some of the things he was doing. Him, I think him mashing chickpeas with a with a can is gonna be one of like a core memory of mine for the rest of my life. Unholy string, dog shit. Okay, dog shit. Island, dog shit. Mountain, dog shit. Forest, dog shit. God, imagine being able to buy one revised pack and like half the fucking pack is lands. Oh my god, jump, Atog, okay, this man, woman, shrimp. Ooh, lightning bolt! I love lightning bolt. I get I get excited for lightning bolt, like it's super valuable, even though I don't think it is in this set. I just I get excited for it. I'm sorry. Swamp. Look at how many dude! You buy one revised pack and you walk away with 15 fucking lands. Uh okay. <sighs> Blessing. <clears throat> Dibs on those lands. Bro, I don't even want to waste time shipping them to you oops all lands lightning bolt is great is does it have value hey can i get some of those lands? booty do you actually need some for your deck the lightning bolt is two to eighteen dollars really sleeves two dollar card but not a 44 dollar card i'm realizing i'm not going to waste time sleeving everyone i'm just moving to the side lightning bolt is two dollars in revised yeah that's i mean it's not like it's cool the fork is almost 50 i'm moving to the side i'm moving them all to the side I'd 100% buy a signed swamp. Why do you want me to sign cards, dude? Circle protection, red, mountain, swamp. I, I mean, like, I have no. What do I have? What, what does my signature mean on the, on the card? It means it lost about healing self, dress skeletons. God, I gotta be real though. This, this, some of this art, man. I love vintage magic art, but I like vintage magic art from a specific time, and that time is not. Revised. Robbie, your dad was actually killing it on stream. He was so entertaining and he it was. was fun watching him enjoy himself. Fair enough. Fair enough. Thank you, CS Star. I see, I see what you said, by the way. That makes sense. Um, some magic, old magic art is really cool. And then you get some like this, and I'm like, yo, did like a fourth grader take over for the horse? Like, what happened? I know that like money was tight for like Alpha, Beta, Unlimited, whatever. <laughs> and they like did what they could, but some of this shit just looks terrible it really it's like this looks cool this looks awesome right love it right i can ask what i would punch my grandma for a sign card from you this one looks okay i like this one this one looks okay i like this one good see some of these are good was this the twelve thousand dollar pack no it's the the whole boxes brother okay rod of rain 
planes. Oh my god, dude, that was one of the uncommons as a plane. That just... Holy shit. Zombie masters. Master. Dog shit, I don't give a fuck about you. Death grip. It goes, it goes, it goes, it goes. It goes, it goes, it goes, it goes. Unholy strength with a flaming pentagram. Yup, dude, yup. That really pissed off the ladies back in the day. Moms everywhere were in shambles, bro. Oh my god, did you guys see there's a new Disney TCG? Have you guys heard about this shit? There's a new Disney TCG that they just pushed. I know nothing about it, but I've been seeing conversation about it. I don't... So, okay. I would love to learn about it. Um, whack? I, earlier views are good. Okay, so I, I'm going to give you guys a quick rant. I'm going to zoom in a little bit because I want a little bit of juice on there. Um, uh, I'm going to talk a little bit of shit, and then I'm going to use to tie that into... To, um, this TC, the Disney TCG. Let me let me go through this pack first because I can't talk and look at cards. I feel like when I'm talking while I look at cards, I have no, I never have anything to say about the cards. Little giant. God, I mean, sorry. Just look at the skull on this horse, bro. <clears throat> Got away from him. Okay, okay. This card was really annoying to get in Arabian Nights. Shatter, cool card. Giant spider. Okay, crystal rod. Okay, dwarven Wobbsmith. We only got a couple more. Browing. <laughs> I think this is the last one. Last card. Here we go. <sighs> Demonic chords. All right. All right. Um, so I was watching a video. I have not played Yu-Gi-Oh! since I was a kid. When I was a child child, I liked collecting Pokemon. And I liked 761... By the way, Mr. Message, even if I don't respond to it, I'm seeing it. I liked collecting um, Pokemon and playing Yu-Gi-Oh! as like a child, right? Yu-Gi-Oh! was cool. Um, and, and I feel like it was... The mechanics of it were more enjoyable as a child. Uh, thank you, Big Bear. I, I don't know if I thanked you. And CSTAR, I don't know if I thank you too. Um, now that I'm older, I decided yesterday, just I was just playing Starfield casually watching YouTube videos, and I watched uh, uh, how to play Yu-Gi-Oh! Like a full game, a newcomer played Yu-Gi-Oh! And while he was playing, uh, he was being taught how to play. And I got to call a spade a spade here. I'm not Yu-Gi-Oh. There is art that I'm very nostalgic for. Dual land incoming. Are you calling it? Wait, Jake, Matt, do you know something I don't know? Hold on, let's get through this pack real quick. Do you know? Do you have? Is it? Do you know something I don't know? Get this bear out of here. Fireball. Love the art for that one. Living wall. Okay. Library of Lang. You're saying dual land. Here we go. You little piece of shit. Ugly. You know, time him out. He gets an hour timeout now. You, you, you interrupted my whole story for this. Time out for a whole hour. Bro was so confident. Anyone else? Any other takers? Okay, anyway. Um, I want the, the resubs run, even if they're silent, just so you guys can, if you see your name pop up. There we go. Um, so I'm going to call Spade a Spade here with Yu-Gi-Oh, guys. And I don't, I hate to be this guy. I know there's a lot of Yu-Gi-Oh fans. And I want to say, too, if you like Yu-Gi-Oh, there's, it's okay. You're, it's okay for you to like it. I have Yu-Gi-Oh cards. I like some Yu-Gi-Oh cards. I like the way they look. Yu-Gi-Oh as a game, as far as I can tell, looks like absolute horseshit, poo-poo, garbage, baby, everything. I can't believe it. Yishki! Thank you for the five subs, brother. Appreciate you. The card game of Yu-Gi-Oh looks like legitimately like watered down baby magic. I'm sorry. Now, I have... Uh, a, a dark magician uh, like I have a decent one that I bought I'm, it's currently getting graded I have a blue eyes from my childhood that's getting graded there are things from Yu-Gi-Oh that I love certain art certain things the show as a kid I liked the card game of Yu-Gi-Oh is bad it is bad bro it is so bad I'm sorry I'm not like and I don't understand how adults are like it, I don't understand how adults seriously go no, no no this is a good balanced fun card game i don't get it i don't get it at all and that's not to say you people who want to collect it and play it even casually that's i have no problem with any of that but like there are people who have chosen Yu-Gi-Oh as their card game of choice and reject magic being like i'm not no that's not for me it's like my brother in christ it's it's i can't even believe they're compared i'm sorry 
I can't even believe they're compared. You're giving a trash take. I'm not saying I'm not saying Yu-Gi-Oh isn't fun, but it is not a Maybe I said it was unfun, so let me take it back then. It's not a competitive or even balanced card game. And for me, when something's super imbalanced, that's not fun. You see what I'm saying? So so maybe it's fun in a mega casual way, but like, I'm not saying go all commit, CEDH, get like everything meta. Oh, this card gets me going, bro. I'm not saying everything has to be meta, but I'm saying when your skills can get thrown out the window because the game is super imbalanced, that is not fun. And from what I don't know much about it, my brother Magic is pay to win. How is that fair? My brother card games in general can be boiled down to pay to win. However, you can still play a fun balanced game where you and your friends at the table agree to play with a power level of between this and this, a card you know level between this and this price, and you can have a fun balanced game of Magic the Gathering. Yu-Gi-Oh is a mess at all levels from what I'm seeing online. Yu-Gi-Oh is an absolute mess of balance from beginner, meta, expensive cheap it just looks like a fucking mess of a card game that was slapped together to try to get into what magic had opened up i'm sorry it just to me it looks like that it looks like they have no clue what they're doing and you know what i'm just gonna say this you know what now you got me going now you actually triggered me nero thank you for the five i'm gonna say this whoever is in charge of writing the descriptions on current or even old Yu-Gi-Oh cards needs to figure out brevity it is insane how wordy these cards are. Oh my god, it is so... Yu-Gi-Oh cards are so needlessly uh, uh, wordy. It is mind-blowing. And you know what's so funny? I know there are going to be Yu-Gi-Oh fans coping right now in my chat going, look at the card you're holding. Look at how many words it has. Actually, dipshit, this card has one word. This card has one word. Regenerate. That is it. Everything else on this card is flavor text. Everything else. I'm sorry, Yu-Gi-Oh! is just so far behind the standard of what a good card game should be. I cannot believe there are adults seriously playing Yu-Gi-Oh! Yishki, thank you for the five, appreciate it. You straight up need a magnifying glass to read some of the fusions effects. Dude, that's what I'm saying. It actually blows my mind. So the the how much small text is crammed into like modern Yu-Gi-Oh cards, right? You can easily criticize dual lands. This is hard to read. Fair. This also came out 30 years ago. So fair. We've learned a lot. What's your excuse, Yu-Gi-Oh? What the fuck? What the fuck? I don't get it. I'm sitting here crimp like sweating into my cards just to rant about this. I couldn't I did not even go into Yu-Gi-Oh this video with the Ooh, I love White Knight. I love White Knight. I did not even go into Yu-Gi-Oh! with the- Ooh, Howling Mine! I haven't pulled this one yet. I don't think I have, at least. Um, I didn't even go into the Yu-Gi-Oh! video to hate it. I just, as I was watching, I'm like, there's no way that it's this crazy to play Yu-Gi-Oh! That's awesome. I love it. I love it. It's only a $9 card. This art is so cool to me. I don't know. feels uh iconic. As a casual fan, Yu-Gi-Oh! is a better enjoyed in- better enjoyed in-game. Yu-Gi-Oh! nerds can suck my blue eyes white dragon. MTG is just better. I mean, MTG is the better card game. Uh, I'm just shocked that Terror is still my favorite in ABUR. It's just perfect. I need to see it. Eat a pack. $1,000 I'll eat a pack. You need to pop off on your T1 or you lose. Oh, you, oh, oh, you're talking about Yu-Gi-Oh! I'm like, what? You, so you, yeah, dude, that's what I, bro. Okay, in, okay. I'm just going to say this. In Magic the Gathering, being able to look through your deck, draw cards, all these things, right? In in you interacting with your deck is the most one of the most powerful things you can do in Magic, right? Drawing cards, scrying, everything is like gold in Magic, right? Because the game is so balanced for that. In I want Yes? I'm so sorry to interrupt. I I wanted to grab one of these. Look at this. I'm going to show this. Yes. I I'm going to yeah. thank you. This is this is very important. Please. And I recognize this card too. In 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 Yu-Gi-Oh, right? I watched one turn. Dude played like nine cards and looked through his deck like four times. And I'm sitting there and I'm like, this can't be balanced. This can't be. Oh, I'm like, bro just did the effects of like four of the most powerful magic cards casually in one turn. And I'm sitting there. And I'm like, 
where's like the mana cost for he's like i put this down i put this down i put this i'm like what you just put three cards face down there's no cost what do you mean like you there what do you there's no like the, it's like balanced by a nine-year-old i swear to god it blows my mind bro annihilated the game in one turn and i'm like what is this shit this lasts like eight minutes are games eight minutes normally like yeah i played arena and i've been steamrolled but in general there's a lot and it takes a lot of time to get a to get steam right to get magic is for pedophiles hey then guess what if magic is for pedophiles I'm not going to finish that statement. Um, okay, so uh, Booty just walked in my room with a card that you might recognize from a mag from uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! called Toon Mermaid. First off, I'd like to point something out. Yu-Gi-Oh! cards are smaller than uh, Magic cards. I've, I'm not mistaken. Unless, wait, am I, uh, oh, maybe they're not. Hmm, I guess I was wrong about that. Whatever. Um, maybe it's just the, well, actually, you'll see when I turn it around. Um, they are smaller? Oh, they are. Oh, okay, they are smaller. They, they are a little bit smaller. Okay, slightly. I, I knew it. Um, I'm going to turn this card around and show you something I hate about Yu-Gi-Oh! That it's just... I, even if you want to say Yu-Gi-Oh! is a good game and Wubby, everything else you said is wrong, you can't deny this. This is objective, okay? The text on Yu-Gi-Oh! cards is so small. It is so small. You ready for this? I'm, okay, I'm serious right now. I can read every word on this card, including the illustration and who it's by. Christopher Rush. Tap, Arcana is add. a pretty fun game okay. for being a Disney brand, but it's plagued by scalpers. Fair. We got a league at my hobby shop, and I like it quite a bit. Like yeah, yeah. Baby MTG. That's okay. See, I, I have no problem with somebody sitting back. Ah, oh, it's fun. I play with my friends. It's a good time. Okay, that's totally fair. Very casual. Nobody really gives a fuck. But, like, there are people who... Like, I just don't get putting all your eggs in the Yu-Gi-Oh! TCG basket when there's just... I don't know, man. I just feel, I feel like... that. I, I don't know. Anyway, let's try to read this. Well, first off, there's no way I can read this from my camera. I'm going to have to actually look at the card up close. I'm going to read this with no exaggeration exactly how at what point I can. Okay. I'm about here, and now I can finally read it. This card cannot be summoned unless Toon World is on the field. This card cannot attack the same turn it's summoned. Pay 500 life points each time this monster attacks. When Toon World is destroyed, this card is also destroyed. If your opponent does not control a Toon Monster on the field, this card may inflict direct damage to your opponent's life points. If a Toon Monster is on your opponent's side of the field, your attacks must target the Toon Monster. This could probably be summarized in like four words. Um, if Yu-Gi-Oh! used the system that Magic uses of making one word mean an effect. I, I'm sorry, but like, why not just like, like, there, there's like, what? There's so what is many... more butt crack at tourneys, MTG or Yu Gi Oh? Uh, well, the fact that magic uh, tournaments actually have people showing up, I would say magic. Hey, yo! So, no, I don't know. I don't know. I have no clue. If we're going to say that magic people are grosser than Yu-Gi-Oh people, I think we're, we're fighting a um, losing argument because I think we can all agree TCG enjoyers in general need to work on their hygiene. Just say haste. Um, but this doesn't even have haste. See, that's... Oh, my God. Man. This is what I mean by brevity. Like, bro, a talented team could have summarized this card into a few words and then had those words mean something you can learn, reference, memorize, and then forever know. It's it's crazy. Look up Relinquish. It has seven lines of text. I know Relinquish. I remember that card from a kid. It's like that ball thing. Yeah. It's it's like, God. It's it, And you know what, too? Like, having to read all of that like while playing a game, it's just, my God. Can you sign that Toon Mermaid and give it to me? Well, I'm going to be honest with you, my man. That belongs to, uh, to Booty. <laughs> So, so, so no, I, I, I actually cannot fear. Oh, okay. Wall mammoth. War mammoth, not wall mammoth. Hey, bud, my bad. The packs are mixed up. You're in a good spot of the sheet, though. Good luck on your pulls. Thank you. Wait, uh, wait. What? I, oh, I'm gonna knock over my camera. Fuck. Bro, the timing on that, bro. The timing on that. Oh, shit, that's two. Okay. We're at two. We're not at the best two, but we're at two. Two dual lands. I'm liking it. I, I'm a little nervous though. Can this ship be mapped? And more importantly, and more importantly, are we gonna get Mr. Volcano? There's a $330 dual land. Let's look at the back. 
I really want to get all these graded, but last time I got my dual lands graded, I got very disappointed. And the centering already looks off quite a bit, actually. God, the centering on the dual lands always fucking sucks. Still, though. I don't have much use for the Mr. Scrub land here. The centering is trash. I can't lie. I listen. You're right. It, it is kind of garbage. Bad centering. But you know what? PSA doesn't even care about centering. Who the fuck grades with PSA? What are you? A, what are you a? What are you a loser? Can I rant about Beckett? Actually, hold on. Fuck grading companies in general. Did you ever get your eight underground C regraded? No, I haven't gotten it regraded. Oh, oh, are we down? Hello, are we down? Hello, are we back? Listen, I'm sorry. I know I'm. I probably just pissed off some Yu-Gi-Oh boys. Can 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 a Yu-Gi-Oh fan in chat try to um try to bridge the gap right now and help me help me you know like help us end on a more positive note because I don't, I don't want to shit on Yu-Gi-Oh. I know that you're allowed to like what you like, you know. You think you're we slick? We all know <laughs> oh, that you bought tens of thousands of dollars of cards <laughs> off stream, paid someone to reseal them, and faked an auction to get the box authenticated, all just so you could impress <laughs> some card nerds on stream. <laughs> Uh, it's a tale as old as time. It's a tale. As, frankly, it is a tale as old as time. It's a song as old as rhyme. Okay, beauty and this volcano. Volcano. Bro, are you fucking kidding me? Hey, Whooptar, don't lie. You're a Yu-Gi-Oh master. Ah, ow, I hurt. I, I'm, I'm, I'm fucking up my whole setup by, by my excitement. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh my God. Bro, let's go. The timing with the dodo stacked. Okay. First off. Yes. Mr. Mustache is pointing out a 503. This one looks kind of, let's take a closer look. This looks kind of minty. Hit the gwitty. Not a volcano, but tropical island. Still fucking good. Good fucking pull. Okay. Let's take a look. Centering is not the worst it's definitely better than the other one but it's also not perfectly centered yeah it's definitely hugging this way a little bit little to the left yeah oh fuck why am i dropping this i probably won't even get it graded let's get a sleeve damn dog i am bricked is this a four thousand dollar card twenty thousand dollars <laughs> fuck it it's a hundred million dollars okay we are let's let's show what we got so far hold on is that two in a row Back to back. Now, hold on, chat. <clears throat> I don't know if it's ever been done. I don't know if it's ever been done, but... Do you guys hear that? I don't know if it's ever been done. <laughs> yeah, pull the plug on the internet, somebody, please. I don't know if it's been done. Any turkeys, huh? Any Thanksgiving lovers? Let's do it. If I get three in a row right now, if I get three in a row, we're opening the Arabian Nights pack. No, no cap, no kizzy. Here we go. If I get three in a row right now, no cap, no kizzy. We got tree beard. Okay. We got, does she have a horse pussy or a woman pussy? Tranquility. Something to think about. Mountain. Plains. Dark ritual. Love this card. Giant growth. We got a big old worm. Fireball. Woman. <clears throat> Rat. Okay. This, I hate this card. Um, Here we go. I think the rare is right here. All right, here we go. Three in a row for the turkey. Give it to us, turkey. It's not possible. I don't think it's possible. Here we go. Uh, <laughs> that is unfortunate. Earthquake. Get out of here. You ruined everything. I know. I know. Well, with that with that uh, unfortunate blunder, it's time for the... Uh, let's do a mega pack. $2 card. No way. A regular card. All right, let's do a mega pack. We're going to do one, two, three. Here's the rare. Had your stream muted on second screen and knew something happened when I looked like a 8.0 earthquake was happening. <laughs> are these beta packs? Yep. No, these are alpha packs. Okay, one, two, three, four. Yeah, this is a $3 million opening today. Okay. Mega pack time. If stream dies now, you guys will know. Uh, favorite color to play? Probably blue. One, two, three, four. Okay, that's three. Beckett rant. I have a uh, 97 cards, I think, currently with Beckett that I'm getting graded. And uh, they're just, you know, I'm just so sick and fucking tired of uh, the speed in which they grade cards. Um, 
every company. This isn't every company problem, but it's driving me fucking crazy. First off, we don't work on weekends. Why not? Why don't you work on weekends? No, I'm not saying overwork people. That's not what I'm saying. I'm saying you're always behind and your employees seem to always be overworked. So hire more employees. I'm sure there are human beings in Texas that want to work, right? And have them work on weekends. Why are you overworking people on weekdays, right? And then, hey, we're overworked. Our times are really slow. Oh, okay. I, I don't want people to be overworked. I understand that. Everyone's off on weekends too. We don't. We only work uh, business days. Okay, so I'm just noticing a problem here. Why not more employees and let those employees choose when they want to work? Okay, so they're all. That's the case, right? And then I also, I paid for a grading service level. This is where it's like I'm. I'm actually wondering. You know, if they don't respond to me, I, I don't know what I'm gonna do. But um, uh, I, I don't know what I can do. I don't think I can do anything except bitch about it to my my community. But. Um, I paid for a grading level that was um, between, I think it was f uh, five and 10 business days, something like that, or 10, 10 and 20. Some, I, don't, I don't remember what it is, right? And so I'm not hearing anything back, and my package arrived, and I'm like, hey, is everything okay? It hasn't started the process. It's been a week. It's been over five business days. What's going on with my package, right? And I get an email that says, hey, we got your package. We're working on it now. Just so you know, uh, the current wait time for the level you selected is one to two months, and I responded, I said, hey, you guys already charged me and took my money. I have a screenshot from the site as of today. Your site is not advertising the price I paid being one to two months. You are still currently advertising what I paid to be a different length. I'm like, that seems illegal to be. I, I literally, I didn't call them out for being illegal, but I, in, the, in the email, so I'm like, hey, here's a screenshot of your site. Here is the price I paid, and here's the estimate your site gives me. It doesn't say roughly. It says between this date and this date is when you get your cards, between 10 and 20 days, whatever it is. But the person in the email just said one to two months. I'm like, if people are sending you guys cards with uh, uh, intent to purchase a package, and the package is changing behind the scenes, and you're not updating it on your site, I may have gone to PSA if I knew it would have been this long. I may have gone to CGC. You know what I'm saying? So I'm in this awkward situation where I'm waiting to hear back from him now, but it's like it's file a complaint with the Better Business Bureau. See, that would be extreme, but like, I don't know. I feel like site still says 10 to 20 days. I pulled the email right now. They said one to two. Currently, our times for your chosen uh, standard, what priority, whatever it is, is one to two months. And I went, one to two months? The fuck? Better Business Bureau is basically Yelp. They're not going to do anything. Well, then why would I do it anyway? Okay, here we have my father. These are all the commons and uncommons. We're going to go through these quick. This card looks sick. Tree beard. Fire. Mountain. Black. Swamp. Tranquility. Curd ape. And uh, that bullshit. Okay. Karma. Black Knight. I like Black Knight too. And I feel like if I said I like White Knight but not Black Knight, I feel like you guys would be mad. So, okay. Hurricane. Island. Water elemental. Tar leak. Idiot. Dark Ritual again. Love Dark Ritual as I bend the card. Sea Worm. Island. I bought these back in the day. Hell yeah, bro. I don't think we need to go through every one of these. I will just go through these quickly. I'll look for anything out of the ordinary. Basalt Monolith. Okay. Why did I think that was a rare? Am I am I stupid? Is that just an uncommon or did I do something wrong here? <laughs> is is <laughs> did, Why are the Island Boys kissing in my chat? Monolith is good. Yup. If anyone says that I'm ending stream, it's an uncommon. It's a $14 uncommon. I'm like, don't worry. I, by, if you're wondering all this huge pile, I'm going to go through it all and see what cards I have missing for the complete set I'm going for. God, they were crazy with it, bro. They were crazy with it back in the day. All right, we have our, ooh, we have our mega pack here just below my right hand, lightning bolt. Love to see it. Okay. <clears throat> Booba. Yes, sir. All right, here we go. We have how many rares is this? Five. We have five rares. <sighs> five rares. The mega pack. The revised mega pack. Kiss of brother. Here we go. Give us a dually. <sighs> Gender was. I know this from. I. I. I have this one in Arabian Nights. Okay. Oh, <sighs> I don't think I pulled this one ever. I don't think I pulled this one. So I was looking at it up close. I don't even, I don't even, it says omelet. Yeah, this one's an omelet. The Fraser background almost got me. <clears throat> okay. We got the omelet. 
Less than a dollar. Dog shit. You swapped it? Well, then I swapped it for worse cards because there ain't no way a volcano's in this pack. All right, we got a Mind Flare. Two more cards. I love these cards. I had them all. Or I had these cards. Uh, my religious brother threw them away. Dude, throw your religious brother away. Sorry. And show him this volcanic island. Uh, why did I... I it's something about it looked like the volcano for a second. I don't even know. It's just smoke. They were just blowing smoke, bro. Last card of the pack. Volcanic island. I'm going to start doing the thing. I'm going to start doing the thing. All right, guys. We pulled... All right, we pulled the tropical island. Okay. We pulled our boy Scrubland. We pulled our boy Bayou. All that's next is the tropical island. Here it is. He switched the packs for worse packs. All right, guys. I'm calling it, and I don't ever do this. You know, we pulled the tropical island. You know, we pulled the Scrubland, and we pulled the Bayou. All that's left right here, and I don't normally do this. All that's left right here is we are going to pull the volcano, our boy. He really never does this. I was here. <laughs> All right. I know we've been talking about a lot of other stuff, and I don't normally do this, but uh, I'm calling it right now. This pack, one take here. One take. This pack, Volcanic Island. I'm calling it. We already pulled the Scrubland. We already pulled the uh, Tropical Island. All right. We, they need to be Island Brothers. Oh, that's why. <laughs> They're going to be... We need to make them Island Boys. Okay. Gloom, get out of here. Wall of Ice. Okay. Planes. Uncommon Planes. And for the rare, trop or not Tropical, Volcanic Island. Goddamn ugly bitch. Ugly, ugly man. Ugly, old, fucking ugly. You're ruining my clip, man. Maybe try Ooh. some reverse psychology. You Why are not you going to pull me? Volcanic Island. You are not going to pull Volcanic Island. Jesus fuck, dude. Jesus fuck. Well, all right, guys. This is it right here. And I'm going to just do this right now. I'm going to take this. This card right here, this is a Volcanic Island. I don't need reverse psychology. Look at that. Give it a nice little scratch, make it not valuable. If this is Volcanic Island, I'm throwing myself off a building because that's centering. Holy shit. That thing is, uh, is this a... Never mind, I'm not going to say it. <sighs> okay, get out of here. You're all useless to me. You're all, you all meaningless to me. You mean nothing. R Uncommon Island! Are we pixelated? We'll pixelate this Volcanic Island. Okay, good. I do like Ivory Tower, though. God, they really fu like. I feel like the revised colors are so fucked up. Can I almost share some bit, right, bro? Ivory Tower is cool as fuck. It really is. Okay, so looks like a penis. Bro, your penis looks like that. Whoops. Ivory Tower is four ten. Well, with that in mind, guys, we pulled. Listen, hey, we pulled the Bayou, we pulled Mr. Scrubs, and we pulled the other island. Mr. Tropical. But now it's time for a lightning bolt volcano with this volcanic island. Okay. Let's make some island boys here. Here. Ooh, source of plowshares. Love this card. Another uncommon. And for the rare. Ugly. What ooh, damn though. She kind of thick with it. Primal clay. God damn. I I don't think you guys can see this well, but she has like the most Sexy little figure going on there. Even her tummy kind of got some pudge in it if you really get in there. <clears throat> I'm about to go primal on that clay. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I can fix her. Bro, I can mold her, you know what I'm saying? <sighs> Looks like Yu-Gi-Oh. Don't get me started again. You just want you want to get me riled up. I know it. Bro, why can't you just oh my god, never mind. Whatever. Whatever, it's all dumb. It's all dumb. Wall of wood. A a a. Your 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 mother has sex with men. There's a joke. Someone piece that together with that card. Someone piece that together. Death ward. We have to go back to the forest, Jack. Sacrifice. Okay. Cool. Get out of here. Clone. And for the rare, 
Just give it to me. Give me the volcano island, you know? You're so ugly. Living lands. I, I really do feel that I will be I'll be rather devastated. I will clone is cool. I will be rather devastated. Hey there, Mapper. Only here. got three. Thanks for not timing me out. You have the chance at a volcanic island. Maybe you'll <gasps> give it away to a chatter. No way. Wait, really? We have a chance of a volcanic island? Oh my god. I'm not giving one of those away. If you guys pull one in your pack, I'm keeping it. Blow me. But that's okay. It's not going to matter because there's going to be one right here. Okay, we get rid of all these. <clears throat> Soul net. Ooh! Famous card! Wow! Animate artifact. And for the rare. Ooh, balance! I don't think... It, er... Maybe I have pulled this one. I do love the way this card looks, though. Love me some balance. Love me some balance. Wow, we very cool card. Very cool looking card. It's only three bucks. Still though, man, I get excited with the way the card looks. Don't care. Curse of cards. Look up the card. Earthbind. That's Earth. Bind. Earthbind. Hala Acha boy. Bro, we pulled Earthbind, and in fact. The only earth we'll be binding right now is this volcano I'm about to show you. Mer people aren't people! Weakness. We have to go back. We have to go back to the drain life chat. Is that normal on there? Am I stupid? I must be stupid. That must be normal. I just swapped the pack, and now with this pack, Volcanic Island. Ooh, Volcanic Island. Here it comes, life tap. Volcanic Island. Here it comes, life tap. Volcanic Island. It's a stupid fucking bell, dude. You know what? This just proves. This proves that you should never buy beta. Any you shouldn't buy any beta, alpha beta, or unlimited. There's so much there's so much sauce in here that isn't the goodies. You know what I mean? Fuck that bell. That bell can suck my dick, but you know what? <laughs> Regeneration had a printing around the name. Wait, right? Okay, that's I said that, but I was like, maybe I'm wrong. It did, yeah, it did. I pointed that out. It looks like a small bullet hole. <laughs> Do you see it? Do you see it? <clears throat> Sealed product is in general a scam. Bro, listen. You don't have to tell me. Did I put the cards to the back? Fuck, did I already do it? I can't remember. I got a magic starter set in 2001 for my birthday, and my parents shredded them because they were satanic. And a week later, 9-11 happened. Oh, wait, that, that means it happened today. Bro, that means it... Wait, what? This isn't a print... Or is this a normal printing error? I can't remember. Or wait, I don't actually know. I, I'm, I'm not even gonna fake it. I have no clue. Is this normal? I'll, I'll, I'll set him to the side. The printing error on the top. Uh, no idea. I have no clue. I think it's part of the art. I have, see, but do we know? I don't know. Yes, my dad works at magic. Well, my dad is Mr. Hasbro. It's a flower? What are you talking about? Google image doesn't show it. I want to grab my complete set. All right. Well, we'll put these to the side. Well, that's interesting. I don't know. My dad is John Magic. Damn it. He got me. Damn it. Damn. Fuck. Fuck. Ooh. Okay. A little flash fire. Okay. Here we go. That's not the right yet. Obsidian Golem and for the Volcanic Island. I mean, Deathlace is a cool card. It looks like an error. It's not normal. Why did it? Okay, but okay. Hold on. Interesting that it's not normal, but why did we get two of it then? That's so odd. Like. In print run? Interesting. Hmm. Uh, whatever. I'll put it to the side. I don't know. I don't know what it. Mm -hmm. Bro, I don't know. I just work here. You're at work, bro. Get to work. Hey, wubby people who have been pegged have a 100% chance of pulling a volcano, so I think you're good. <clears throat> yes. Uh, I will be the guy who gets pegged if I could pull a volcanic island. I don't give a fuck, dude. Well, let's see if we pull another one. Now I'm looking. Keep an eye out, chat. Maybe we'll find something. Oh, oh, oh. oh. Keep, an <laughs> keep, keep an eye on me. Go, me, gang! Sorry, maybe I got a little too excited there. I didn't, I didn't mean to scare you. <clears throat> God, even this fucking tree could get it. 
fucking this wall of fire could get it, bro. Are you kidding me? And this volcanic island that I'm about to pull. You're so copy. I like copy artifact. This is great fucking card. Fuck you. You're not what I wanted. All I ever wanted, all I ever needed is here in my. I'll give you fifty. I'll give fifty subs for the horny card if you sign. Oh, D are you kidding me? Deal. Um. All I ever wanted, all I ever needed is here in my arms. Words are very unnecessary. That's not the right song. What the fuck? That was not what I was looking for. That is so not it. There we go. Jesus. Regenerate. Doesn't look like that can confirm. I've never seen that kind of error before, personally. Weird, right? Did I put the cards in the back? I don't even remember. Fuck. I'm gonna find out. Oh, I don't think I did. Copy artifacts, 58 bucks. I don't remember what I did with the Ice Dweller, you actually did it? Oh my god, okay. Ice Dweller, send your shipping information to Booty, please. Jesus Christ, dude. Why, bro? Well, thank you. Um, no, I didn't. Fuck, we'll find out. I wanted Dark Ritual! It's my magic cards! This song's about me holding magic! Ooh, unsummon. Okay, we're back here. Okay, we're back here. Fucking, I hate pirate ship, bro. I hate pirate ship. Is this even a rare? I don't even remember. Whatever. Come on, come on, Bog Wraith. Come on, Bog Wraith, give me the volcanic island. Three, two, three, two. Three, two, one. Three, two. Run out of packs. Running out of packs. I'm from the future. The second pack from the bottom. All right, future man. All right, future man. You're about to get fucking future banned. Let's see if that was in the cards, bitch. Get cranked on, loser. Bro, crank this fucking dick. Watch this. You want to see cranked? You want to see cranked, bro? Crank this, bitch. Watch this. Death Ward. Oh, he's got pasta cheese on his hands! He's got Velveeta! There was a cooking incident! Come on! Water lust. I do like that card. Death Knight, or Black Knight. Ban that fucking guy. Ban that fucking guy. Ban that fucking guy. All I ever needed is here. So I always look like the Mortal Kombat symbol me. Oh! Sorry, I love Counterspell. Vice versa. I actually like that card too. Let me this side. What's the name of the song? I believe the name of the song is, um... Can 
I have another song. What's a good song to pull a volcanic island to? Bro, the centering on this card could get absolutely bent, bro. The centering on this card could get absolutely bent, bro. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? What is this song that it's recommending to me now? <laughs> no, dude. This song has been ruined, bro. Druid! Oh, it's been a while, boys. It's been a while. But we're here. And you're safe. And you know, the Volcanic Island might not be in this pack, but it'll be in this box. And that's all that matters. If you need a friend, if you need a friend don't look to a stranger. Tunnel. Don't look to a stranger. Death Alex. Clock. I ejaculate fire would be pretty good. Ooh, I'll always be there. And when you're in doubt, 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 doubt. And when you're in danger, take a look all around. And I'll, and I'll be there. I just like the art of Dolly. I'm sorry, but I just think Come on. Come on. Five packs left. Five packs left. Oh, is this the card he likes? Spooky. When your day is through, and so is your temper, you know what to do. Soul Ring, hello. Sometimes if I shout, sometimes if I shout. It's not what's intended. These words just out. We don't want to. It's like, come on, man. I'm sorry, but I'm just thinking of the ride. Was a promise. I know they don't sound the way I planned. We need them to be island brothers. I'm like grandma at the slot machine, bro. I see that. I recognize that. Lightning bolt, fog. Was there two left or one left? That was it. You're a piece of shit. No one likes you. Any dig cards, we pulled these. But I really want the volcano. And we're gonna pull the volcano right now! Whoa, 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 whoa. Chat, this pack is thin. Chat, this pack is very thin. This chat, this pack is very thin. What the fuck? This pack is very thin. There are probably like five cards in here. What the fuck is this? Holy shit. This pack is very thin. It does not even appear to be resealed. This is a minty looking pack. What the fuck? Okay, hold on. What the fuck is this? You guys are saying scammed, but legitimately, this is good. That We've had good... Do not open it. What the fuck could it even be? Count the packs. Okay, yeah, let's count the packs. So it should be 36. Is it an extra? I've lit, dude, it's an error pack. Do not open it. Well, what could be in it? Okay, let's count the packs. We have, I'm gonna count every pack I have here. I'm gonna move this back over here. It's got the one ring. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'm gonna pack, count every pack. I'm sorry if it's time consuming. Nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 
22. If you use the hydro flask measuring standard, they are exactly the same 24, size. 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Oh shit. 31, 32, 33. Wait. 33, 34, 33. No, it's th that counts as a pack. That is count they are count that is being counted as a pack. Unless my math is wrong, which means that is an error pack? Chat, we just learned that Wubby can count past 10 without using his fingers and toes. <laughs> what? You guys are saying scammed, but I don't I don't think it's that simple. You don't understand. Okay, for those who don't know, <clears throat> I'll honestly send this to Rudy and have him open it up. This is super rare. No, bro, I want this content. <clears throat> okay, let us let me talk to you guys why this isn't a scam. Be here's the thing. Here's why I know for a fact this isn't a scam. This box is too perfect. You wouldn't go through a box, leave th these three poles, leave every other pack, and then take... Like, that's not how you scam a box, right? This does not make sense. This is not... A this is insane. I don't even understand. There's probably like six cards in here, or maybe even less. <clears throat> it's a $25,000 pack. Check eBay. No, it's not. Hold on. Let, I'm going to count one more time. Okay, hold on, hold on. Here's one, two, three. Right, we won't count this one. So, okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31. Okay, it does seem right. What the fuck? Do the packs feel heavier? Dude, this, I'm telling you guys, if it's not clear on camera, look, 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 look at the size difference. There it is. Look at that. Look at that. Are you able to weigh and compare it? Uh, sure I am, but, um, fuck, where's Booty's scale? Booty, did I give you your scale back or is it still in here? It's crazy. It's not one card. I can definitely feel a couple cards in there at least. Look at the difference, bro. That's gotta be like maybe three cards. This is... Oh, wait, Booty, I think I got it. I got it, I got it, I got it. I got it in here, I got it in here. <clears throat> okay, so... Okay, a normal... Oh, my God, sorry. This is this is your pack, chat, sorry. This is that one, and then this is this one. Okay, so here is chat's pack, for example. Okay. <clears throat> 26, 5, 26.48, 26.46. Let's just try it this way. Twenty six five is about where I'd put it. Okay, here's this crazy pack. Ready? This super thin. It's even. It's like. It's even like tight. Like it. Like like the pack. Do you see this right here? This is all air because like I feel like the pack didn't know what to do. Okay, and then this one. Seven point five. Can you check to make sure your desk is level? Holy shit, dude. Can you weigh an empty pack as well? I will do that for you. Here is what an empty pack weighs. Let's let's try. I'm gonna weigh both of these one more time. Let's do it all one more time. Okay, so here's what an empty pack weighs. 0. I'd give it around 0. 0.6. The wind is affecting it. 0. 0.6. Okay, that's empty pack. Full normal pack. 0. 0.6. 0. 0. 0. 0.26. 0.5, I would say. 26.5-ish. It's bouncing around 4.8, okay? This light pack. Seven point. Holy shit, dude. Holy shit. Weigh a single card? I'll do that too. Here's uh, the rare that we just pulled. I'm going to weigh this as well. So there's like three, four cards in there. Like, 
There are three cards in there. What the fuck? What do we do? What do we do now? <clears throat> do not open it. Okay, let's let me hold on. I'm gonna do this for for posterity. Give me a second. I'll be right back. Okay, sorry about that, guys. Sorry about that. Um, I think what I really want to do is figure out if it's worth anything. Um, but until I know what it's worth, I'm going to protect it. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if it could, it, could, it could just be just the uncommons, right? It could be three commons. I don't know. I don't know what it's worth. Um... Uh, there is 3.8 cards in the pack based on the weight. 3.8? So with, with margin of error, that would mean it's probably four cards, right? Called John Magic. I'm also, just so you guys know, I'm going to put tamper proof on it. I should probably sign up first. I don't have a pen, do I? Uh, happens Booty to WTC Pokemon semi-common. Booty, do you have, um... Buddy, do you have a pen or a marker I could borrow? I mean, listen, I'm not implying that this is worth anything. I don't know. I think that's why I'm trying to be careful with it. Booty, could you bring me a Sharpie if you can hear me? Is Booty a new character? Bo no, Booty works for me. Honestly, just send it to PSA. What though? What would they even do? I, I don't even know. This, my friend. Thank does you. the wrapping itself feel different or does it feel like I'll the see. others but with extra space? Um... It, it it feels like the others, but, like, it's been compressed because there's less cards to resist the weight. Does that make sense? Like, the other cards, the, the, I don't know how to describe what I'm saying. Um, it feels compressed because there was less cards. Okay. What's the date today? 9, 4, 23. Give it a little PMW Siggy. Okay. <clears throat> what is it with you being cursed with air packs? I don't know. I know this is cornball, but the professor from Tolarian Community College could probably have a lot. I what's what's cornball? I fucking love him, dude. I love to, the Tolarian professor, dude. Are you kidding me? Nothing cornball about him. I fucking love him. He's theatrical and goofy, but I love him. Uh, that's insane. Got to be worth 10k. Why do you even say that though? Like, like I'm not, I'm not in trying to impose value on this because I pulled it. I'm saying I have, I this could be worth nothing. I have no clue. 10k to who? Yeah, I know. I don't know. I don't know what. I, what is this even? What like, chat? What are we even holding right now? Is this just simply? Oh, they a factory error. Three cards got in instead of the normal amount. It's just three. It's just three fucking random cards. <clears throat> or is it see it could be three rares I'd say call Magic Johnson but you would never get him he has aids for this type of stuff <laughs> is it is it most likely a factor error still rare though right but which here's the question right which sheet did it pull three cards from <clears throat> 
That's a huge error. How does that even happen? Brother of War Brothers of War had wait wait. Brothers of War had six card all rare packs that got out. Shine a light through it and search the pack. You guys think I should search it? <sighs> let me let me just look online if there's any like error revised packs anywhere right now. Because if there are, I'm I'm curious. No, don't search it. Well, what's good? I'm in a very unique situation in that this pack has been seen by the public uh, only on camera. And now I've sealed it in a way that you know if it's been looked at. You've seen every second of this boy's birth, um, which does give it some amount of value, right? Even just to this community, it's unique. Okay, hold on. Revised MTG error pack? I don't even, like, this is so obscure. There's nothing. I don't even have it. Revised booster pack still sealed. What is that? <laughs> Revised booster pack. There's no, I can't. There's literally nothing online about it. This is so niche. <clears throat> it's a reseal for real. Uh, hey, that... Wubby, what should I do with the rest of the cards we took from that? Stop, that stop, 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 oh, stop, stop. <clears throat> um, there's a Tavis King YouTube video on it. Okay, Tavis is the guy, though. Tavis... King revised error packs. Uh, where, can you link it? There's no chance it's a resealed box. Yeah, it, I'm sorry to burst your buble, but uh, this is not a resealed box. Uh, there's no, I'm sorry, let me rephrase because this is how you should word things online, right? There is no evidence that's been presented in anything we've seen today that would indicate that this is a resealed box. There is absolutely no evidence. And this weird pack is not evidence of resealing. And if you understood how resealing worked, you would understand what I'm saying. Um, there's no evidence to support that at all. I don't know if this is resealed, but I have no reason to believe it's resealed. Okay. Ta oh, Tavis King does have a video on it. Wait, if if he says it's not valuable, then we're going to open it. But he, dude, Tavis, bro, this fucking dude, I love Tavis, by the way. <clears throat> I bought stuff from him before. I've spoken to him before. This guy is, when he inevitably passes away as as all human beings do i hope to god he just writes down everything in his brain because this man is like the nichiest niche 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 of magic dude is an encyclopedia for shit you shouldn't know and like his videos get not a lot of views not a lot of people are that interested but he still knows this is mr magic this is john magic welcome, welcome to, to oh god <clears throat> Sorry, I wasn't expecting the the goon squad here. Unhinged magi. Oh man, they're such dorks. Okay, that's okay though. We love them. Let's see if we can skim this video and get an answer. All right. Tavis edition. <laughs> There's the man. We don't have to put cool. up the bat signal this time. So we just got done doing a live stream of gaming. And if you guys missed it, that's too bad. Go check out the old video on the channel. It was a lot of fun. We all that's got to play actually this time. Exactly. My first time playing uh, over the internet. So that's, that's cool. cool. So now we like to say when people come on the show with us, they're officially unhinged Magi members. So now, oh my God, come on. But we actually have the man here to talk about that thin revised pack because apparently it's going to sell on eBay very soon and it's not going to be in our hands yeah, very much longer. We put it up there. It's up $1,100. So it's already, what? It, did you hear what he just said? A thin revised pack is up. They sold one for over $1,000. What? No, wait, but what he just said is so important. Today's video, like you saw in the title, we actually have the man here to talk about that thin revised pack because apparently it's going to sell on eBay very soon and it's not going to be in our hands yeah, very much longer. We put it up there. It's up $1,100. So I can see the title yet. Yeah, we'll just, it's right there. You can't, just, it. you can't see it right <laughs> the video? Just stand up and go around. Slow it down. Do Dolly just said the middle guy looked like old Wubby. Okay, now, first off, okay, that's a little mean. But also, I don't mind that. I love Tavis. Tavis is the middle guy. He is like the most gentle encyclopedia of of magic in the whole world and i would love to grow up to be this man like honest to god unless this dude like i don't know gutted a kid when he was 19 i don't know we don't know that about him but in general i'm just saying he's so he's just every time i've spoken to him every video i've watched he's just so nice and he knows everything and he's so helpful he doesn't gatekeep watch now i hit play and he just screams the n-word or something like totally out of, out of left field <laughs> oh, <that's laughs> <from here. laughs> yeah, so this auction is going to close in like two days uh, from the time we're filming it now. We're going to try to have this video up and ready for you guys to watch it tomorrow, Monday. But it's still Sunday for us at the moment. So yeah, it's one of our last chances to see this thing before this thing goes. So we want to yeah. get some words from the man here, see if he had any information to throw at us. So yeah, it's a revised pack without very many cards. It's pretty obvious. Uh, we don't switch the camera. There it is. I can do both. And I can move that one. Oh, picture in picture here, huh? High yeah. Stuff. And, and you're doing some high quality things. Oh, that's the wrong one. There's there. Yeah, okay, sorry. Blue. There we go. All right.
Check the auction link to see what it reached. I will do that. Someone in set someone in chat skip to 445. I will. Somebody in chat just said they opened it and it had four basic lands in it. Let's let's see. Let's see. It's rare, I think it's uncommon. All we know is the machine made a mistake. So I'm gonna flip these around. So just go ahead and keep talking. Yeah. So as far as value, um, I've seen these before. It's it's pretty rare. Um, but uh, value, I've seen them go for like you know, five times normal value, stuff like that. But typically that's on cheaper uh, value packs. We don't see it very often on such a an old expensive pack. And so I'm not sure what the market ceiling is gonna be. Um, I don't know if this would go. See, like, like five times value on a newer pack would be like you know twenty to fifty dollars, something like that. Well, these are going for five hundred. Sealed for a revised yeah. pack. So and five, five times, times value is like two thousand five hundred. Yeah, that's a lot of money. Yeah. So I don't know if it's gonna be like fifty dollars over regular price. I know it's way past that already. Um, or if it's gonna be closer to the five times value. But uh, it's like eleven hundred right now. Last I looked. Yeah. But there's like we just looked at it a little bit. Ago. There's an insane number of people that are actually following the auction. It's like three thousand people no, are watching. No, no, three thousand people have viewed it. Oh, he's like yeah. one hundred forty-seven watchers or something. Okay. I'm pulling it up right now so we can go check that. That's that's still a lot of people. And the way eBay works, you're gonna get a lot of visits at the end. Like everyone tries to snipe yeah. eBay. So With they, all this, they need to get rid of that. They do. They yeah, do. no, it, that's literally what he just. I'll explain if you guys can't hear. I'll explain everything. He's valuing it. He said at newer packs, it can go for five times pack value, but he's like, you rarely see it with old packs like this, so it's very hard to say. He also said that the current bid is like a thousand whatever, but he said how eBay works. And by the way, this is just very true. The last five minutes of eBay bidding, you see 90% of price increase because everybody's waiting to snipe. Everyone's waiting to get, uh, please move us. Oh, oh, I'm so sorry. I didn't even, you guys are totally right. My mistake. Um, uh, so he's saying the price right now, there's no, this is so, oh God, what he's describing is something I think most of you haven't experienced yet with this shit, but this is so true. With Magic Oddities, you go, how much is it worth? And we go, I have no fucking clue until the auction closes. And even when the auction closes, how much attention did the auction have? Do people know what was happening? It's like, basically the price is set at what it's about to be paid for. And here's what that looks like. Hey, who wants to buy this? Does someone want to buy this for a dollar? My chat, someone wants this for a dollar? Yeah? Okay, does anyone in chat want it for $2? And we go up. Dude, that's literally how prices like this are set, right? What about, would someone pay $3 for it? See what I mean? Boom. That's what's going to happen with this if I decide to sell it. When I bought my international collection, the price went up 10K in the last 10 minutes. Bro, exactly. Exactly. You have international collections. That's awesome. Um, so this is, this is, man, I'm going to keep watching yeah, to see what else he says. I'll turn it up. Um, it's a little quiet. I, I know. I'm sorry. Oh, no, it's a normal stream. Everybody look away. Ah! Yep, yeah, 3,404 views on this, this auction. 77 watchers, yeah. Yep. So that we have more people watching the stream than people watching that eBay listing, which is definitely fascinating. Not that all of you would bid, because you definitely wouldn't, but it is, it is interesting. I'm thinking there's going to be some fireworks going off on this thing at the very end. Right, yeah. yep. We'll all find out. Oh, I was thinking about the whole, you submit a box to them. Yeah. Uh, there would be no point to actually have them label it, because you'd have the serial numbers. Oh, okay, yeah, makes sense. So you've never heard of anything like this before this came up for revised? Um, not that I recall for revised. I know I've seen it for Ice Age. This is, I'm sorry, but... This is so fucking cool to me. I don't even know what I'm going to do with it, sell it, anything, but this is just to be a part of something this fucking rare has got to be one of the coolest experiences as a Magic fan in the world. Is that an artist, like, uh, uh, what is it, a proof, is that what you call it, of Library of Alexandria signed? Yo, fuck that guy. Fuck whoever owns that. That's so cool. Um, uh, the misprint guy, uh, Keith, he opened an Ice Age one uh, on video. Uh, someone sent in requested that it be opened. I don't recommend opening these. That's, that's a bad idea. It's just regular cards inside them. Even if they're all yeah. rares, you're destroying the value by opening. Even if that was like... Oh, did you see what Tavis just said? Is so exactly what I needed to hear from someone I respect. I'm going to replay that if you didn't hear it. Uh, the misprint guy, uh, Keith, he opened an Ice Age one uh, on video. Uh, someone sent in and requested that it be open. I don't recommend opening these. That's, that's a bad idea. It's just regular cards inside them. Even if they're all yeah. theirs, you're destroying the value by opening. Even if that was... Real. Tavis, real. Like, say it was four cards. Yeah. And it was four underground seats, which, which is, I'm sure it's not. Yeah. Even if it was that, you're still going to ruin the value. Yeah, yeah. Opening definitely leave it sealed. This is something for the, the misprint community, for sure. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, Dan here's opened up uh, Fallen Empires. Packs. I didn't even remember it. Yeah, they're on a full box opening video for Fallen Empires. Um, so you're saying how much money did I throw out the window? At least 50 bucks, probably. Dang it! Yeah, for, yeah. for a pack that was probably $2 at the time. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's been a little while. We even had people on the live stream when this came out of the box. They were immediately making us offers. Right away, huh? Yeah. yeah. Dang, bro. Oh, but see, I am a gremlin because I am not like some of these magic people. Here, let me tell you what's, what's wrong with my brain. Here's my problem. I see dollar signs, right? And I go, why shouldn't I keep it, though? <laughs> I don't want to sell it. What if I just keep it? What if it, what if it stays in my collection forever and I and I you know get the pack graded and keep it? It's a cool bit of magic history. Not only is that true, but it's a cool bit of magic history that I birthed. Like this this can't I put like pulling a card is so different than buying a card. Well, those are smart people. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, our subscribers, smart people. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, it's, this is really interesting. I'm excited to see this go with the fireworks I, on it. I'm excited to see what market price is. That's what I'm excited. Yeah, me too. Yeah. Yep.
Man, I, I was so like, dude, someone's gonna get taken the hose down if I send this to him. That was my biggest concern. Yeah, right. at first we were actually afraid. When the thing first popped out of the box, we thought like if it is a pretty common misprint, and then we just give this to someone as one of their packs, and then they're missing all these cards. But yeah, now we have to suck. Yeah, yeah. And so we, so we had no idea. Cards. Since people were trying to buy it, there was like no way we could solve the randomization. Yeah, you know, because that's you know. But so we, figured, yep. we came up with solutions. <laughs> to the people offering me ten, twenty, thirty dollars in chat, you guys should pull together. <laughs> Do we know what's in the rest of the box? Uh, There's only like four packs that have been opened so far. Yeah. I know people have asked me, but I haven't looked at it yet. It's so. been terrible rares. It's like yeah, yeah. web, like one, one of the laces. Lace. The bottom left of the sheet. Yeah, one of the laces came out. Pure um, lace. Pure lace? Yeah. Like, I don't remember yeah. which lace. But you're like not great cards, honestly, okay. that popped out of the box so far. So we're looking at across the bottom. Hmm. All mm -hmm. right. But I mean, who knows? Tavis, by the way, knows every fucking sheet. It's insane. He can map. Bro, whenever they're opening expensive packs and Tavis is there, he'll just be standing there quietly and they'll go, Tavis? And he'll go, okay, so we're here on the here and you're going to pull this card next. He'll start naming every card you're going to pull. This one next. This one next. I'm like, bro, Tavis. Tavis is crazy. So this is even as rare, so. It's so funny that you have the sheet just like in your head like yeah, that. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's like. Did you hear what he just said? Did, is this pre-watched? Did you hear what he just said? Is this fucking pre-watched? Hey, Wubby, but what out. if it hits? Um, pure lace? Yeah. I don't remember yeah. which lace. But you're like not great cards, honestly. Okay. I popped out of the box so far. So we're looking at it across the bottom. Hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. But I mean, who knows if this is even as rare, so. It's so funny that you have the sheet just like in your head like yeah. that. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's like right there. Three cards in. We're good. He knows the sheet. He knows the printing sheet. Bro's crazy. Yeah. I can't because it's too fast. Yeah. Okay, brain. so yeah, there you go, guys. Me, the thin me pack. Zoomer brain. Even, even the history. Okay, well, we just learned everything about the thin pack, and ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to introduce you to the newest thin pack in the world. This is insane. Um, let's see what it sold for. Um, I learned literally nothing. Well, you learned here. Take this is the takeaway. You learned that legitimately, you just witnessed his magic history today on this uh, on the stream. Something happened today that you will probably never see ever again for the rest of your life um, in Magic the Gathering, ever. I clicked the eBay link, by the way, in their description, and it, it uh, errors out. The link no longer, because eBay, I don't know why they do this. They don't let you see old, uh, thin, revised pack. Um, let me see if I can look for sold items, but it doesn't show old sold items. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hunt for this for just a second. Use the Wayback Machine? But will the Wayback Machine show me when it closed? Only downside is that your volcano is in there, probably. A volcano, a single volcano ain't worth it. That's the thing. That, like, a single volcano, like, like, dude, did you not hear Tavis? Did you not hear King Tavis just now? Did you not hear King Tavis? Okay. Only works if it's archived. Open the eBay app, it shows up. Has anyone ever pulled... Congrats on the pulling content, Ms. G History Live. Has anyone ever pulled and tamper sealed and signed it on camera? I believe that's what Tavis's video was showing. I don't know the hit story of, of, of that. Hold on one second, guys. I gotta open this on, um, on my phone. Um, what's on your arm? I don't know, some fucking... I paid a dude like thousands of dollars to permanently ink me. Um, and it's just, it looks terrible. I don't know. You know, I'm just stuck like this forever now. All right, hold on. Uh, the first Tiger you pull for my Cheeto finger sleeveless CDH deck. DJ, ignore me. I just sent you a link. I'm just trying to open this on mobile because people are saying. Welcome to the party. <laughs> dude, the, Magic needs like a new guard. I love Tavis and open boosters and all them, but like. No, it doesn't work on mobile, you dipshit asshole. <laughs> what are you talking about? Why do people just speak? Got him? What's the got him? You're sitting here. This is more boring. Um. Okay, I'm gonna. It works on my laptop. All right, all right. I'll hold on, guys. I gotta go get my laptop. All right, let me continue searching as I was now before I was interrupted. Uh, I have this pulled up here. If anybody, I mean, if you guys want, I don't want to say do it for me. Um, if someone wants to look it up and try to find it, like the sold listing, I'm sure a sleuth could do it. Call Tavis. Yeah, these are all things I can do off stream, right? Like I can absolutely hit up Tavis at like, hey, I just pulled one. What did it sell for? What do you think I should do? But that's all good. You're going to get an update days later. I want to see if we can get updates now, like right now. I'm browsing through sold revised pack listings. None of them. It, it's not there. It's just not there. Uh, do it on stream. Okay, I'll message Tavis right now. 
I'll message Tavis right now. Let's see if he responds. What's the eBay link? It's in the video. Type in, t okay, here, I'll link this video. All right, here's the video where I'm getting the eBay link from. Okay, I put it in chat. Uh, I'm looking as well, I can't find it. All right, let me, let me message Tavis. Tavis is online right now. Hey, Tavis. I, I just pulled while live a thin pack of revised. We researched and found your video to be one of only to be one of the only references to this happening. I also saw the eBay listing you linked. However, it is no longer visible. <laughs> Don't make fun of me. I see you guys. Um, um, I was, I was wondering if you could provide any info. It worked on my eBay app. It sold for one thousand three hundred and eighty-four dollars. I will post screenshot on the subreddit. Post it. Po wait, why did, why did I even message Tavis? Uh, we were just grabbing beer. I hope chat doesn't realize my keyboard isn't even plugged in. <laughs> okay, I said, we researched and found your video to be one of, to be one of the only references to this happening. I also saw the eBay listing you linked, however, it no longer... It is no longer visible. I was wondering if you could provide any info on the previously sold thin pack. Okay, so I I I, I messaged Tavis now. Um, if it's a thousand bucks, like that's definitely awesome. Um, that was how long ago was that? That was two years ago. So the price has definitely gone up. Um, but do I want to sell it for somewhere between what, like two and four thousand dollars? Maybe. But I think I kind of maybe want to hold on to it. I mean, this is. This is so rare. Expired listing. Here it is. There it is. And also, I feel like, yeah, it sold for 1300 I can't even believe it sold for that two years ago. Also, here, I'll show chat. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm not showing you guys. Uh... Sealed revised booster pack unhinged. Guaranteed unsearched. Unboxed on video. Yeah. Yeah, so it's this, this would be the second one ever then. That's crazy. That is crazy. I what you know what would really what would really tell me? I want to know what was pulled from it. Could be the last one that ever gets pulled again. Never sell it. Keep it for sure. Description says they opened it. What'd they pull? Was it all lands? Is that what he was saying? <laughs> Um, I mean, guys, no matter what, hey, listen, I'm not going to try to turn this into a monetization moment for me, but these magic Mondays can't happen without your prime subs, guys. <laughs> now, but that being said, real talk, yes, bait, all bait aside though, real talk, this is like one of the coolest magic Mondays ever and real talk, it couldn't happen without you guys showing up, watching caring letting me do this not a lot of content creators would probably feel comfortable straying away hard left turn from their normal content to open magic cards and you guys like watching it you show up you beg for it we do it and because of that everyone sitting here whether you like magic or not got to witness a probably no matter how not cool you think it is probably once in a lifetime opening for something that will probably never happen again on video ever I mean, arguably, right? Um, and because of that, for 100 subs, I'm going to flip and rip it. <laughs> Bro, the timing on that was actually legendary. Thank you. I see subs coming in. I, I, I want to get this speech out. 
without acknowledging them because I don't want you to think it was just bait. Genuinely, this was really fucking cool. This is really fucking cool. We still have two more packs to open, plus the pack to give away to someone in chat. So I'm excited. This was really cool. I could cry because this is what this is what I fucking care about with magic, dude. This is more rare than pulling like a black lotus from a, a like one of the ABU sets. This is more this is the most rare thing that will probably ever happen to me in terms of magic openings. I like seriously, it's more rare than getting the 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 neon pink neo genesis whatever bullshit from that set. This is more rare. I mean, this is probably the most rare pull I will ever have in Magic the Gathering ever. It's so rare. We're achieving levels of do people like you have to find the buyer because there's probably one of like 19 people in this world who would even buy it. Crazy, crazy, crazy. There's more likely less of these ever than serialized Lord of the Rings cards. Yeah, yeah. Well, there you go. There you go. Cool, 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 cool. Ah, this is so cool. Okay. Wow, I wonder what's in it. Ah, I can, ah, it's gonna kill me. This is so cool. How fucking cool is that? Are you kidding me? <laughs> it's even more rare than me ever touching the chicken because I did not. Okay, dad. Jesus fucking Christ, dude. Bro, let me be happy. I want to have fun. Isn't it cool for people to have fun? Uh, done milking this content? Open the rest. I'm just going to ban you. I'm sorry. I'm banning you. I'm actually just... you, Dude, you have been a uh, one and a half year sub, and you threw it all away. That sucks. Yep. eBay description says no dual lands or anything in the entire box, so your box was better anyway. Fair. Fair. Um... Magic Monday is my day, and I, uh, this is very cool and exciting to me. So there's not, I don't even, I don't even think I'm milking this. That's what's so, there's not, not even milk. This deserve, I'm sorry, but if you understand the concepts we're talking about here, this is not being milked. This deserves the time I'm putting into it to, uh, to, to talk about this. It would be, I personally feel this would be in, like, as someone who loves magic, it's almost insulting to be like, can you just move on and open the other two packs? Bro, there's thousands of videos. Go watch videos of pack openings for Revised. You know what? I've never seen this in my, and I'll never see this again. Lick my balls. I feel bad. I'm going to unban you, but I'm going to give you a 24-hour timeout. I feel bad. I'm sorry. I do feel bad. That's just because I'm empathetic, not because you didn't do something wrong. Okay? All right. Moving on. Thank you to uh, Comeback King for your subs. I appreciate you. I saw this come in. And CS Star, thank you for the 25 as well. I appreciate you. Uh, all right, we have two more packs left. So we put, hey, we pulled, hey, we pulled the thin pack. We pulled the scrubland. We pulled the bayou. We pulled the tropical. It's time for the volcanic, boys. It's time for the volcanic. Check the pin message. What was the pin message? What was the pin message? If this is a volcanic island, this will be the most perfect day of Magic: The Gathering, ever. Linked clip of another one being found. Curtis of uh, another one being found. Ooh, I'm gonna watch it. Did they know what it was too? Oh, I'll watch it after this. Hold on, wait, let's move on. I'll, I'll watch it after this. I'm gonna I'll watch it after this. That's crazy though. There's probably been less than ten ever found of across the board, right? How many of revised have been pulled? Like, gotta be very. I mean, this has got to be one of the most rare things to ever happen. It only takes five boxes. <laughs> Life force. Come on, just make this the best opening of all time. Make this the best opening of all time. Make this the best opening of all time. <sighs> will the wisp okay will the wisp not quite not quite not quite it's the same pack it's just that guy who found it oh well then chat's wrong chat's saying okay it's it's the same pack so then even less then i love will the wisp okay but let me ask you a question cs star do you love will of the wisp more than this volcanic island that i'm about to pull the answer is no that's some Willy Wonka golden ticket shit. It's not like life changing, but like, I don't know. If you love magic, it's kind of one of the coolest things ever to have happen, right? You know, you can go buy a, uh, let me, let me explain it like this, right? You can go buy a Black Lotus. Any one of you in the whole world right now 
The only thing stopping you is affordability, right? But you can, in theory, go buy a Black Lotus, right? Do you want to know what's different that you can't do? You can't open one. You can't open it. Post Malone bought the one ring, but you know what? There's only one person on planet Earth who got the experience of pulling it. And let me tell you, that's the, that right there is a feeling that people will chase. You can't get... It, it's not even about making money. It's, it's just... Pulling a Black Lotus would be the hobby done for me. I'm retiring from the hobby. I don't even need the Lotus. I don't want... I don't, I don't simp over a Lotus, but pulling a Lotus would be hobby done. I'm good. That's it. Ooh. I think I just knocked the rare off. I don't know which one of these is the rare. I don't know if you guys saw it, but I didn't see it. So I'm going to go through now. I don't know if you guys saw it. I definitely did not see it. So I'm going to turn this over. I don't... Okay. Oh, my God. Okay. Here we go. The last revised pack. This one we will be giving away to chat. Subs only. What if you pull a library from that Arabian Nights pack? I would fucking scream. Okay. Here we go. Last pack. Uh, last. Let, this one we're going to do a giveaway in a minute to subs only. Here we go. Three, two, one. Last pack for me. Ooh, I like, okay, not the best ever, but a good pull for me. Not disappointed, not happy, but not disappointed. All right. Really cool card. Love that card. Um, all right, chat. It's the worst card ever. I like it a lot. So why don't you lick my dick? Let's do a Nightbot giveaway. The code is Wubby7 to enter. And you know what? I've... I've, I've changed my mind. I'm opening your pack regardless. I'm opening your pack regardless. Uh, so uh, let's see here. Subs. Keyword is Wubby7. Uh. All right. Uh, if you're a non-sub putting it in, it's, it doesn't grab you. I have Nightbot grabbing only subs. So non-subs, you're not skirting the system. By doing a highlighted message or by putting a message in right now, it, it only pulls from the people who are subbed. So I see you guys doing that. It literally cannot win. And even more importantly, if it somehow does, if your name somehow slips through the cracks, I'm going to just silently ban you. I won't even, I'm not even going to point it out that you won somehow. I'm just going to hit ban move on. If I win, can I flip one, rip one? Booty, if you win, it's your pack. So you may flip one, rip one. Okay. Congratulations to the winner of this pack, which I will be opening. Here we go, Nightbot. I'm just going to hit roll. Three, two, one. Congratulations to followers since 2021 and a subscriber, Dank Jones 77 Dank Jones 77 Here we go, Dank Jones. Here is your pack. Let's see what you got. I'm going to try to keep the pack in the best shape I can. That's a really clean open of a pack right there. Okay, here we go, Dank Jones. Congrats, it is Wubby's alt. There is your rare, not centered. Let's take a look. Here are all the cards you got. You got a mountain. Circle Protection White. You know what I'm noticing? These cards are a little bent. Look at the, the rock it has. That's because the pack was thin. The thin pack fucked it up, I believe. Very weird. Blue Elemental. Okay. We have the scene from uh, Terminator. Cope, what's what are you coping? This is the only. These are the most bent cards, and they were on the same stack as that. Whatever. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm wrong. You could be right, but the the, the box feels crooked now. Forest. Okay, we got the young terrain. Minotaur. Plains. Fog. We got Mr. Ghoul coming up here. Crumble. If you pull a Volcanic Island, I'm just ending stream. Seriously, I'm taking it. I'm not lying to you. If, you, if this is a Volcanic Island, I'm taking it all back. I'll give you something else. If this is a Volcanic Island, I'm giving you something else. I don't care. Call me Scammer. Look me in the eyes. Call me Scammer. I don't care. I'll refund your sub, bro. I'll ban you. I'll make you disappear. If this is a Volcanic Island, I'll make you fucking disappear. I do not give a fuck. Here we go. Okay. And for the rare. Oh, thank God. Fuck you. Yes, suck my dick. <laughs> 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 hey but congratulations my man still cool fun pack awesome uh it's a 50 cent card you pulled man we got lucky bro big pulls of the night big pulls of the night look like this uh listen 
This box was meh. This box was mid, except for this. And now this changed it, in my opinion. I like these are great. These are not small pulls, right? But I've opened revised boxes that were top tier, and I have to compare it against that. These are big pulls. Um, this is the biggest pull. This is insane. This is really cool. This is gonna be awesome. So save that. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. <clears throat> Average for revise is three to five per box. You had one where you pulled six. That was the go to box. Yup, bro. Yup. That was so good. Noper's brother, keep it sealed. You got an air pack, man. Just switch it out. <laughs> uh, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go look for a screwdriver. And in that time, this is what's going to determine it. Okay. If we hit the sub goal by the time I sit back down, I'll open it. If, I, if we don't, I will sleep well. I will put this away and I won't open it. It's not bait. Vote with your sub. Okay. If you want to see it, I will know you'll want to see it if that sub goal is over the mark by the time I get back. If you do want to see, or if you don't want to see it, then it won't be. It's that easy, okay? You are voting with your dollar here. I am not offended if you don't. This is not a person. I am going to go look for a screwdriver, screwdriver, and when I come back, I'll be back. I'm back. What is the verdict? All right, let me see. I don't, the, the sub count is usually delayed by like a couple moments here. Not even moments, it's usually minutes. Okay, hold on. We were a hundred and, were we behind? We were like a hundred and eighty. Let me just count. A lot of subs coming in now that I walk back in the room. Oh, we def, uh, actually. Okay, hold on. We had, What's the exploit point sub count? What's it saying? We did it? Did we hit it? Okay, we did it. All right. <clears throat> uh, thank you to the Comeback King, CS Star, DJ Narski, Crusher, Jammin, Juggernaut, It's Me QC, Why Not Zoyberg, Whiff Raff, I'm Spackle, thank you. Mr. Mustache, Gustafer. Wow, Mr. Mustache wanted to see it, huh? Okay. Uh, Anonymous, thank you. Uh, Electric Shock, a lot of tier ones coming in. Thank you guys. Bayo Loon, Dasky Chan, Cloud Strafer, thank you, brother. Blue Lapta, Maxwell Chungus, thank you. And Rymek, thank you. And then all the people who just use their primes. Okay, so let's see. Um, let me first justify this. A couple things I want to say. First thing, Arabian Nights cards, I love them all. I love every single one, every common, every uncommon. You know, I'm excited to get every card from this pack. That's one. Two, I actually hate PSA's old uh uh 
pack grading system. I hate this. I hate how it's folded. I actually don't like it at all. I can't stand it. Um, so it's a gem mint 10. Yep, I know. I know. Wait, what? Bro, 27. Wait, this is 32. Hold on, hold on, hold on. This is $32,000. No, it's not. It's not what it's selling for. Oh, it's not. It's nowhere near that much. 20K last sold. Wait, no, it's not. What? Wait, what? Hold on. No, it's not. That, that wouldn't make any sense. Okay, th there's one best offer 20K on eBay, not sold. They're literally gaslighting you. No, yeah, no, not at all. No. No. 8723 sold for 199. No, no, no. Okay. That was or best offer. So a best offer was accepted on this. It didn't actually sell. No, no, no. Chat, you got to trust me on this. Last sold was below 4500. Exactly what I'm saying, bro. That's exactly. Don't listen to these Ooh. retards. Highest sold was 5k. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. No, it would say best offer accepted. My brother in Christ, I'll say, okay, I'll just come right out and say this. If this sold for 20K, someone got scammed. There you go. Do you want me to say it? If this sold for 20K, somebody got scammed. Like, absolutely fucking scammed. Even, uh, I will concede that maybe you're right. I don't think you are. But um, this getting sold for 20K is a scam, bro. When, when a box that I think is overpriced is going for 30, 375000 and you get 60 packs, 60 times 20000 is not 375000 That guy, that's crazy. I think it sold for $20 million. All right. Now, here's the thing, though. Are we going to even be able to get into this? Um, you should tweet Post Malone about the error pack. I don't think he cares about it. How do you even get into these? How do you even get into this? What the fuck are you doing? Pliers to the side, clip the corner. These aren't pliers, though. Clip the corner. Scissors, call your dad. This is going to be a disaster. Use the toenail clippers. That's such a good call. How much did you buy the pack for? I don't remember. I bought it a while ago. Thousands. Do you have flush cutters for 3D printing? I have tiny ones. I have like really tiny flush cutters somewhere on this desk, actually. They're not big, though. <sighs> Whoever is asking about an invite to the wedding, you need to ask the business email. Oh, true. all right, fuck it. This isn't going to work. Best offer was sold for thirty-seven fifty. There you go. Um. 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 Don't use the snippers. Um. <laughs> These are booties. It says right on that page, the seller relisted the 20K pack. Same exact PSA number as well. <laughs> Booty, don't come in here. I'm fixing them. Hold on. Booty, don't come in here. I am fixing them. Hold on. Why is it always Booty stuff? The brain. Hey, Wubbies, do you need any more of my stuff to break? Wait, maybe if I unscrew it, actually. Hold on, this.
Just everybody shut up, okay? I'm working on it, okay? This... Fuck. Uh, what did I ever do to you? Nothing, but I thought we were homies. I'm we sad are. now. I am too, I'm sorry. Oh my god, what the fuck is this, bro? No, no! Oh yeah, I'll take those though, but don't look at me. Thank you. Thanks, booty. Oh, I fixed it! I fixed it. Totally fixed. Totally fixed, chat. Good as new. Good as new. Now we have the big boys. The trouble. The trouble just came. Is this even gonna work? Fuck it. Let's just find out. I don't give a fuck. Those are strippers. What the fuck? Bro, I'm a stripper. <laughs> so what's going on here? This... Alex, did you see? We pulled... I know you're out right now. We pulled a, a extremely rare pack. Uh, only one other one has been pulled publicly. This is a, a revised thin pack. We had to do some research. My grandma gave me um, those when she was in the backseat of the car, fingering herself. We, we had to do research to even figure out what this was. This pack is sealed, revised, and it's thin. It only has three to four cards in it. And we had to do all this research. And chat, tell them. Tell them how cool it is. Chat, tell her how cool it is. And we had to do all this research. Check YouTube for how Rudy opens the cards. The car, I could open the card. The PSA card is different. These are, it's like a thicker plastic here. So, oh, so wait, was it search? No, 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 no. This is a rare, very, very rare We're misprint. We're gonna move on. Like, like extremely rare misprint um, where they incorrectly packed the cards at the factory. Uh, okay, Last Mint 10 seen. Arabian Nights was sold for seven, 5K on Heritage Auctions. Oh, wait, I think I figured it out based on Rudy's video. Yep. Yep, I'm in there. I'm in there, bitch. I'm fucking your whole day up, bitch. I'm in your whole shit, bitch. I'm in your shit, bitch. I'm in your dick, bitch. I'm in your shit, dick, bitch. I'm in your dick. Okay, let's, uh, I can't do this. Uh, this is really hard. Okay, I'm trying to scout my boo here. <sighs> oh, I didn't search it if that's what you were asking. Okay, this is like, bro, is this sealed with like the power of raw or something? What is this shit? It's scary because I don't want to hurt myself, right? Like I don't want my tool to slip and then, you know, like fucking, you know, get AIDS. Breathe, Wubby? No, I'm having fun. It's sealed by the power of Christ, dude. <laughs> Just break the edges off. You don't understand. It's not, it's, 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 okay, look. See this? There's no... Like, this is... I just want to know if there's my freaking library in here. Let me, let me see if there's a way to... How to open PSA graded pack. Um, how to open... No, it's just showing me cards. I don't want the cards. Booty, do we have anything more powerful? <laughs> do we have anything more powerful than this? Do we have like a hydraulic press or something? <laughs> Get a buzzsaw or a lightsaber. Are you guys living just in a fucking fantasy? Oh, here we go. How to crack a PSA slab. If this is the same video. Say cracking video. And on the... Okay, wrap it up. Could I don't need to fucking... maybe put the corner in the blender, but you broke that too. What the new grade? Okay, you um... guys keep linking me how to open slabs. This is not a slab. This is a much different setup than those. Those are much easier to snip because they're much thinner. Look at the thickness of this. It's not the same. Get a hot knife. I don't have time to vet the, you know, attractiveness of different knives around the house, bro. Like, we don't have time. Get a can opener. Get a hammer. I think a hammer might be helpful. I can shoot at it. A box cutter. Ooh, wait, a sharp knife. I have a sharp knife. By the way, I found a knife in the middle of the stream, which was kind of funny. Okay, I have a sharp knife here, but I don't know what this is gonna do. Are you doing anything? Are you helping at all? Mother of Pearl. Bobby's gonna go to the ER. 
Cool, me and my cat bowl. Wubby, I got a guy on the phone. He says he has a plasma cutter for rent. Are we down or nah? We're down. Hey, Wubby, don't worry. I'm on my way. Thanks, Dad. <laughs> Just get a saw. Pliers on corner, twist to crack the plastic. Okay, pliers on corner. Okay. I can't. I gotta pick my nose. Just twist it and crack it a little. Ah! Okay, the corner is so thick. I don't think you guys understand. This corner is like. Oh my god, there's no way, dude. I'll keep doing it though. I'm closing my eyes in case it. Oh! Oh shit! Oh shit, I'm in. Oh my god, I'm in. I'm in. You know, oh son. Booty, I'm in. Booty, I'm in. I'm good. I'm in. I'm in. Booty, I'm in. I'm good. I'm good, booty. You don't need a. I'm. Holy shit, is that a saw? I think, okay, I got it. I got it. Thank you. Oh! Oh, I'm in. Thank you, booty. Booty came back with a saw. I'm in, boys. Hold on, I'm trying not to get, go blind from this, so just give me a second. Sniff it. Hold on. Yeah, I'm glad that wasn't my face. I just heard something go flying, bro. I'm actually going to do this under the table so I don't damage my... <laughs> you got your safety squints on? I'm going to do this under the table so I don't damage my monitors as shit is flying around the room. Because this is just like acrylic being sent at fucking warp speed right now. So hold on. Can't wait to be digging this out of my cat's paws at another date. That'll be fun. It's all part of the magic experience, though. That's what they tell you. This is what Richard Garfield intended. He wanted you to claw your way to a pack that's been sealed in a fucking space case. This is what they wanted. It's like I'm trying not to hurt myself. I'm trying not to hurt the pack. I'm trying not to do everything. I already scratched the pack, but it's okay. I'm not reselling the pack. I just want the cards. Ah, oh, fuck, dude. Oh my god. Yeah, this pack would not get graded to 10 anymore. <laughs> Pussies. Pack grading is silly to me. I'm not big on it. Never been big on it. Which is why I'm also pretty comfortable opening this. It's not a fan. I don't know. I don't really care. It just seems so silly to me. It's like, how do you determine if a pack looks good? <laughs> like, what does it even mean? I'm just rambling now. I'm sorry, guys. Okay, I think there's enough space here to pull this thing out. Yep, got it. Got it. <laughs> I freed you! Okay, let me let me clean up a little bit. Um I'm not I I know some people. I I the dude uh um uh, Ed the guy, the creator of uh Isaac, he is a big believer in like free your fucking free your did that pack break itself out? It looks like it. He believes in freeing your cards from slabs. It's, he's joked around with me about that because I collect sealed. He's oh, like, uh, boy, if your hand slipped down there, you would have lost a nut. Um, and uh, I, I don't agree with that. I, I like sealed cards. I think it preserves them, right? Like, I know you should have cards to play with, obviously, and playing is the point, but sealed cards I, I have a special place for it. But sealed packs, I just don't get it. I don't get it. I'm not big on it. I have very few. I think this is the only sealed pack I have now. Like I, I mean, encased. Not like this. I mean, like, graded. I'm trying to think if I have any others. I don't think I have any others. They're just kind of dumb. I don't know. Okay, let's take a look here now at... Oh, I think I've only ever opened one of these packs ever. Or maybe two. Maybe one or two. Arabian Nights is my favorite set in Magic the Gathering. Um, and uh, I love it. I love the art. You can tell. Doesn't this look so much better than Revised? Oh my god, I love it. We have the Bazaar. We have the Juzam Jin, City of Brass, uh, Library of Alexandria. Okay, I hate saying this name because every time I fucking say it, someone corrects me. So we have Blue Guy. I'm not going to try to say it. Diamond Valley, Pog, Guardian Beast, Pog, Drop of Honey, Pog. Uh, unfortunately for me, I own every card on screen in 9.5 already. 
but I don't care because Arabian Nights is my favorite set and getting to open uh, one of these cards is super cool. If I open any of these, if I open Library of Alexandria, if I open Bizarre Baghdad, I will feel whole. I will feel like my childhood was had purpose, you know? There was a reason for it all. Now, before I open this though, I need to look at a video to see where the rare pops up because I'm not gonna fuck this up because, noteworthy, these packs, Arabian Nights was sold in 60 booster pack boxes where the pack only contains eight cards. So less cards, less content, more um, ways to fuck it up. I'm going to find this real quick um, to see where the rare actually pops up. While I do that, I'm going to play a song for you guys. YouTube! Oh. Welcome back to the Power 9 Qu Where it's flat and immense and the heat Hey guys, I realized to find the rare, I have to keep that on. Uh, Where's the rare? only eight kit? cards. And, and so look, I like to keep my rappers. Subs and I stab this fucker. No, 100 subs wouldn't pay for stabbing this. This one's not for sale, boys, sorry. It's already breaking. I'm... What a terrible start. Oh my god, the way... I'm just gonna show you guys. The way this dude is opening the pack is... My nightmare as somebody who opens. This. Look at this, Terry. I'm gonna try to salvage this. <laughs> oh my god! Right down the middle. This is the, the only Arabian Nights booster pack that I will ever have. Or, you know, not maybe not ever have. All right, so there we go. Where's the rare? Uh, it's a little dark in my kitchen. I might have to lighten this up in in the editing sequence. Okay. All right. Is the rare just on the front? Be ready. Card number one. Or or is the is the rare on the front? Elephant. And, uh, well, we're not off to a great start when it, when it comes to centering. Does he pull a bazaar? This fucker pulls a bazaar, I think. Four elephant. Ur graders. I think this is... I do have, like, in my... Just from having magic cards since I was 14 years old, I have a handful of them. And I, of course, have Ur graders. I feel like everyone had that card. Desert nomads. Beautiful. Okay. Sandstorm. It's all, you're almost over. Kurt Ape, one of my favorite cards. I, I Love me some guy. Kurt Ape. All right, so one more before we hit the heavy hitters. Oh, Wiley, Wiley, Wiley Wolf, whatever it is. Isn't the, the... Hey, man, I don't know how to say it either. You know, usually just type it. The light version, the hard one to get? Yes. Okay, and the big ones. Oh, <gasps> God! Fuck, I got that. Needs... So wait, the rare is second from the back? <laughs> I did it. Or from the... Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh, and this is Ernie Dijin. That's also... Oh, my God. Yes, that is one of my favorite cards. Uh, from the set, I used to what hits, bro? Oh Always my god! I still do have my decks. Just gonna have to change them. But oh my gosh! Bizarre Baghdad is an uncommon. Wait. Oh, so the wait, man. I don't know that. Okay, hold on. So wait, how does he do this? I just want to make sure we don't fuck this up. Oh my gosh! There's no rares, only common and uncommon. You're right. It's You're right. Only eight cards. Oh gosh! Oh, he saw it. He saw. Ah, uh, you little, you little faker. You saw it. Okay, we're not gonna make the same mistake. Yeah, no, you're right. You're right. Okay, here we go. Um, I'm nervous. Here we go. Oh, fuck. Okay. <sighs> it's barbaric, but hey, it's home. When the winds from the east and the suns from the west and the sand in the glass is right, come on down, stop on by, hop a carpet and fly to another Arabian night. Arabian night. Okay, I have to pause it because I want this to exist as history. We are opening an Arabian Nights pack that was at one point graded a 10, but we freed it from its prison. We freed it from all it had known, and it is now going to be in my possession. We are hoping for anything good here. Anything that you see on the bottom of your screen would be great. I'd say the, the worst thing that I probably wouldn't be that excited for is probably Drop of Honey, which is the card on the far right, because I've already pulled that. I am starting to feel myself shake a little, but I'm going to try to hide that, because uh, real men don't shake when they open Curd the cardboard. Penis. <laughs> oh, 
I t did it wrong again. I did it wrong too. I did it wrong too, and I didn't see what it was. But maybe you guys saw. Don't tell me. I'm gonna, I'm gonna minimize my chat now. I did it wrong too. But I knew how to open the pack because I'm not an animal. I'm gonna minimize because I didn't want. I don't want to see what chat saw because I know chat saw it. Here we go. All right, first card. <sighs> focus, focus. Why? You, what's happening here? First card. <gasps> Army of Allah. Love Army of Allah. Great card. One of these days, this card's gonna get banned. I guarantee it. I just like every card, so get ready for those stupid reactions. Sandstorm, eh, not that interesting. Can we focus? Why are we not focusing here? Dude, the camera's deciding to go crazy. Hello! Thank you, Jesus. Whew. Up next, we have, I don't know where to pull from. I don't normally open cards like this. Uh, kind of a boring card. The cavalry, whatever. Still cool, though. It's just quiet. I just hear nothing but the sound of my conditioned air. Ooh, little flying man. Good card. There we go. Jesus, focus. Okay, we're at four cards. There's only four left. Gorilla, curd ape, penis incoming, maybe, if we're lucky. Ooh, desert, not the mirage variant. Ah! Wouldn't that have been hype? So there's a variant of this where there's a small white dot in the center and it is recognized as not just a misprint necessarily, but an intentional Mirage variant. This is not the rare version of it, but still cool, a cool desert. And we have three cards left. Okay, we're about to start with the uncommons after this. A fucking stupid turtle, nobody cares. Okay. Well, we'll start with the one we saw already. We saw some of it, which would be this one. I don't know what it was, but it was white. Here we go. Sharazad, okay, fine, good, decent card, not bad. Not the best, but not bad. I'll take it. Good card, right? Three, two, one. Gorilla penis. My God, Wubby. Oh, I've had that queued God. up for like 30 oh, minutes waiting on you to pull some gas. Bro, a bazaar. What a pack opening, bro. Sorry, I need to calm down. I need to get back on screen. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Let's fucking go. Oh, my God. What the fuck? I pulled a bazaar. I pulled a fucking bazaar. I'm not even going to touch it again. I need to get it sleeved. I pulled a fucking bazaar. Holy shit. It looks so good, too. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. That's on the bottom left of the screen, chat. That look, it's one of the fucking look! Oh, I'm so glad we opened it! Holy fuck! The dude who sold this to me! Get fucked! Get fucked! Okay. Oh. Oh, oh, I'm freaking out. This is the best opening ever, dude. Oh, it's so minty. I'm not this did Oh my head is throbbing. Okay, I need to calm down. I'm sorry. I need to calm down. Alright! Alright! I need a, I need a different sleep. I need a, I want to I want to I want to oh. Calm down. Wubby, bring it in. Bring it in, Wubby. Bring it in. Bring it in, Wubby. Bring it in. Take a breath. I know. I know. Sorry. This set means so much to me. Bizarre is one of my favorite cards in Magic the Gathering. Pulling one is I know this is really 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 lame, but pulling one is kind of emotional for me. I mean, fuck, dude. Bring it in. Bring it in. Bring it in. All right, bring it. I don't even know. How, oh, fuck. Dude, I he pulled a bazaar, then we pulled a bazaar. Yeah, get in there. Get in there. Get in there. This looks minty as. Fuck, dude. This looks minty as fuck, bro. That is... Uh, turn upside down. That is not bad. That is not bad. Oh my god. Holy centering, Batman. Some of the best centering you'll see with a card this old. Dude, I'm freaking out. 
Our bitch here got overshined. Outshined. I can't even speak this. I don't speak Spanish. I pulled a fucking bizarre, dude. Let's go. What the fuck? Are you kidding me? I can't even. Mr. Mustache, how fucking crazy is that, dude? Oh my god. Focus, focus. Well, boys, that's it. That is that's just crazy. You pulled that. Just weird. Actually, some would say bizarre. Oh! Hey, man. Hey. Hey, get over it. You know what I'm saying? Get, get, hey, get over it. You know? What a magic Monday. That's it. We hit everything. That's it. To think, to think, dude. This pack was sitting in, like, whoever graded this pack should have just searched it and opened it. This pack was, oh my God, that's like, you guys don't even realize how much this pack must have been through to get here, containing one of the most valuable cards in the entire set, one of the most famous cards in the entire set. Just this whole to someone, probably 30 years ago, someone had it, maybe it sat in their, in their, in their closet for all those years, then some bozo's like, I'm going to make money off this, I'm going to get them all graded, ships it off to get graded, it comes back a 10, he's super happy, sells it to this person, this person, it ends up at my desk, we do something so stupid, and we crack this bad boy, and we did it, <laughs> on Labor Day too, <laughs> alright boys, well, Next week, um, I will pro I, my goal next week is to be doing, um, I mean, this, dude, if I was browsing, just chatting, and I saw some dude doing opening magic cards, and he had a Arabian, an empty Arabian Nights booster pack on the table, and he was holding a, a cased Bazaar of Baghdad, I would go into his chat, and I would scream at him. I would get, go into his chat, and I would just spam, kill yourself, kill you, I'm, oh, get banned, I'm reporting you, you're a pedophile. I would be screaming. Sorry, this is so cool to me. All right. Um, I'm going to try to do Magic Monday uh, next Monday. That is my goal. I'm waiting on my new, my Eldraine boxes, my Wilds of Eldraine boxes. If those come, we'll do a really juicy Magic Monday next week. 9-11 Magic Monday. Um, but I need those boxes to come because I don't have any boxes to open at this point. So everybody who watched tonight, thank you. Everybody who subbed, thank you. Even just watching will encourage me to keep doing this, so I appreciate you guys. 12,000 of you gathered for this event this evening, and that is so cool, and that makes it so worth it. I'll see you guys on Wednesday. Have a nice Labor Day. Have a really good Tuesday. Pet your pets for me. Thank you guys so much.